Oh, fuck yes. Oh, fuck yeah. Yes, 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 yes. Hello. I am back after just streaming the, uh, direct an hour, an hour and a half ago. Um, today is kind of a, kind of a packed day, huh? Uh, so, if you've been watching my stream since the beginning, which I can't imagine most people have, um, you know that Freedom Planet was kind of like a big deal for me? It was kind of the first game I streamed, and, uh, I loved it. And I've been looking forward to this game for a long time. I actually streamed the version, like, 0 0.1 demo that came out way back in 2017. So it has been a, a very long time coming, but it's out today. Full version. Uh, I've configured everything to hopefully work well. The Switch control is a little weird because the confirm is B. So it's like PlayStation confirmation rather than Nintendo with A being on the side. I have configured the settings, though, so hopefully everything should just work. Uh, let me just do some sound checks here, because it sounds a little low. There we go. It sounds good to me, but it might be a little too loud. Hold up. All right, we'll, we'll kick it down, like, down to 30. There we go, perfect. If I need to, I can just adjust my monitor on my end. Okay, cool. So, yeah, I played the demo of this a while ago. It was literally one level with the three characters. It also looked like ass because the resolution, like, scaled to my, uh, my computer's resolution. Which, at the time, I was using that potato of a laptop. So, <laughs> didn't really work too well. But yeah, I've streamed Freedom Planet four times, one for each character, including the unfinished uh, beta mode of the fourth one. Uh, and now it is 2022. It is f six to five years, well, six years. Oh, more than six years since I played the original. And uh, we're back with the second game, which I don't know much about it outside of, you know, that demo and a few screenshots. So I'm looking forward to it. I know people kind of, people have opinions about the presentation of this of the first game, I really liked it. I'm honestly more concerned because the second game looks the art style looks a bit different, but we'll, we'll see how it is when we get into it. it. Looks a lot less silly, but from this menu, I could kind of tell these menus in this opening. I can kind of tell it's probably not going to be too different. All right, so yeah, so there's four characters instead of three, and I do believe there's stuff for doing it with all four of them. So. Speed type, Dragon Cyclone, Hair Whip, Dragon Boost, Guard plus Blink Dash. So there's a new Guard move, and I don't know how that works. Brawler type, Pounce, Claw Combo, Jump Disc, Guard. Explorer type, Puppy Float, Crane Combo, Barrier Summon Cube. Oh, that's right, she's um she's a doggo. I, I keep thinking she's a rabbit. She's not near us. So she was a character in the first game, but she was not playable. Power type, Double Jump, Cryo Staff, Frost Arts, Focus. I guess Focus, what's six? Uh-oh, hold on. Again, it's really weird, because for me, it's B is confirm and A is cancel. Six is... Okay, so I set that to be, um... I set that to be the R button. Whoops. I set that to be the R button, so that should be okay. For me, it was a whole... She's a hound, not a bunny. <laughs> Auto guard... Oh, right. I remember this from the demo. Uh, so it, it works a little differently. Um... You get like certain you get certain items if you pick different difficulties. Element burst crystals to pedals. Auto guard is on continue cost fifty. Double damage no so normal is like okay ex experts two hindrances and beginners just you get to uh, continue a lot. See that worries me. I'm worried about the continuing thing. Would you like to play a brief tutorial explaining the basic controls? Okay sure. It's been a while. Hey Izzy, doggo. I'm playing as the dragon though. Welcome to Avalis. Follow the signs on the basic controls for Lilac. Yeah, for some reason it thinks my Switch Pro controllers left, right, up, and down are axes. Axis 9 and 10. Also, it keeps saying, like, I put the... There's an option for Nintendo buttons, but it's showing the basic numbers instead. So I have that set to B, which would be confirm. That's that. Hold 
Oh, you can. You can attack while you're in the air. Okay. Alright. It's not too different. I actually recently played some of Freedom Planet 1. Because I have it on Switch. I got it for like 5 bucks. It was on sale. And I was like, sure. Alright, I gotta make sure I'm not hitting Y as often as I am. Black special moves a powerful and speedy dragon boost using some punch energy meter in the top left, which regenerates over time as you collect crystals. Ooh, it gets a little, little quick there. Also, yeah, there's screen zoom in. I, I seem to remember that from the original, because it gets, yeah, it zooms out pretty far. I can lower the amount of zoom in it does, but I don't think the zoom out distance. Attacking it when pressing the attack button depends on which direction you're holding when you're in midair. Experiment with different comp- oh! Okay, so we get the upwards uppercut. Get a kick down. And if you're holding left, you slash, but if you're holding, if you just press A, you, you kick. Okay. Also, Cyclone no longer takes up special energy, which I believe it does in the original. Uh-oh. What'd I do? What happened? The game, like, froze for a second. Actually, you know what? I'm gonna change it. Guard, I put guard on R. Spe I, I want to put special on R. And then I'll put guard on L. So, basic guard, and if you hold it, you blink dash. Okay. Game already looks great. Yeah, it does. It definitely feels better than the demo did. I remember that demo feeling very janky. But I guess that's what happens when you have five years to work on it. Drop slopes and walls, just keep holding that in this direction. Just right, okay. Right. The game's also very generous with walking on, uh, walls. And that's it. If you ever need a refresher detail, check the guide in the pause menu. Full speed ahead. Yeah. I barely remember the story of the first game. There was an alien, he teamed up with one of the leaders of the world and got his head chopped off. Something like that? I don't know. Water. Undyne. That was some tongue. <laughs> Three years later, in a valley to the northeast, But not fast enough! Oh no! Carol! Uh... Return to checkpoint. Restart stage. Quit to map. Oh, there's a map? Oh wow, they, they even have a photo mode. Incredible. Cool. And I got an achievement for that. Uh, guide. Crouch. Climb ladders. A split second shield will appear will appear that'll protect you from damage. If you press right while you're knocked out, you can spend a stock to revive yourself without having to restart at an earlier point in the stage. Be careful though, another hit will knock you out again unless you collect life petals. Press two to whip enemies with lilac's hair. This attack hits twice, one for each hair tendril. Oh, okay, so if you die, you just go back to a checkpoint. It just means you can't you can revive. Press one in the air and lilac will spin like a top. You can use the glide across gaps while running on. Yeah, okay. Rising slash dive kick. Dragon boost. Boost breaker. Press three, a second time to use boost breaker. Lilac cancel a boost and leave behind an explosion that damages enemies. Ooh. Use the teleport escapes. Okay, 300 for an extra stock. Life meter. Convert to crystals. They can be used to craft gold gems. You can also contain bravo stones or music vinyls. Uh, protects character from two hits of damage. Five elements are wood, earth, water, fire, and metal. Each element provides immunity to a specific type of attacks, but they also provide unique benefits. Protection from poison, pulls life petals towards you. 
Protection from rocks and crystals pulls crystals towards you. Protection from bubbles, infinite oxygen. It spawns life petals after collecting 20 gems. Allows walking on spikes with the metal one. Okay, uh, I'm gonna go back here for just a second. I'm gonna change guard to L and special to R. There we go. Perfect. Actually, wait, no, not perfect. Uh, let me switch attack to... There, why? Okay. Perfect. Alright, I have to change one more thing, because I don't want that assist. Uh, where is... V-Sync, text animation, auto-zoom, active guy, there we go. I'll keep that off. Auto-zoom, keep it on low, mid, oh, let's change it to mid. Screen size, we're not changing. Filter is really weird. I don't know why they have, like, a CRT filter in this, but it's alright. We can just turn it, keep it off. There we go. Nice, clean, free of clutter. Pretty good. It's it's as I remember it. I really cared for filters like that in games. Yeah, Battle Network Collection is gonna have something like that, and it looks awful. Speaking of, we'll be getting Battle Network Collection later this week. Uh, not not the not the game. We'll be getting info later this week at TGS. That'll be Thursday. You know, I'm surprised there was no Sonic Frontiers trailer in the direct. Very, uh, very odd, but I guess the game is pretty close to release at this point. As weird as it is to think about, it is pretty close to release. I mean, I'll be, I gotta say, this, the screen zoom does not distract me too much. This art style looks so, so different from the first game, yeah. A lot less chibi. They grew up. Freedom Planet, all grown up. Also, hey again, Toxie, how you doing? I get the point of screen filters like that, but I'd rather not get go back to fuzzy screens, yeah. I'm doing pretty good. Pretty good. Just enjoying... Enjoy the game. Wait a minute, wait a minute, there's something over there. Oh no, never mind. I don't think there's cards, like, in the first game. I think now it's all the music CDs instead. Because that was how you got music in the first game, you got cards. You don't actually get comboed there, you just get hit once. This game's very sparkly. Checkpoint, nice. Let's go up, yes it does.
I don't know how the levels in this are structured yet. So this is gonna be this is gonna be a learning experience for us all. Whoa. Okay, no, it does hit multiple times. You actually just have more than two hits per, uh, per flower. I think it's less, it's less of a dot segmented health bar and more of a just, um, kind of like point value type thing. Checkpoint. This was in the, this was the demo stage. I remember this boss. A lot smoother than it was back in 2017. Instrument. No, no, no! Whoa, what happened here? Where were you? I told you to stay put! I've been put for weeks! I'm not a house cat! Carol, there have been attacks all over! I needed you to watch the house! Sheesh, I'm not your watchdog either. Watchdog? Oh, please. You go out, like, all the time! What, like you don't? Besides, what did you expect me to do? Hey, Mr. 400 Ton Robot, you better not crash into our house at Mach 5 or me and my motorcycle will really show you what's what. That's not the... <sighs> I just... Never mind. I don't want to fight about this. Hey, come on. Don't be like that. We can fix this. No sweat. I know. It's just... These attacks are really getting out of control. I'm running myself ragged chasing after them all. Pshaw! Those things don't stand a chance against world-saving pros like us. Yeah, I guess, but this'll take weeks to fix. Months, even. Hmm. Still well, don't know what the premise here is. Stay at Mila's for now. She runs a lab, not a bed and breakfast. But still, maybe she'd know what to do. Dragon Valley. Okay, so that was straight up the area from the first game. Basic tutorial. So there's like two that oh looks so it looks like there's a music CD, a card, and something else to collect in there. That's interesting. I like this map. There's an airplane down there. Singing Water Temple, quick shop. Oh cool, so if you wanna if you just wanna get items from a shop if they have one, just do it from there. Select this thing to slot empty. Bonus 10%. Yeah, there's like some kind of crafting thing in this game, but I'm not sure what it is. Oh, the 
the sound balance yeah. is not super great. It's on such late notice, but could we crash at your place tonight? Our house was destroyed by this giant robot, and we need a place to stay while we fix up I the- I brought snacks! Please, come right in. Mi laboratorio es su laboratorio. Uh, say what? Oh, uh, never mind. Just don't touch anything that's glowing. Or moving. Or growing. She's a scientist? I thought she was like a little kid in the first game. Also, there's a little face on that stump. Coming! Oh, Lady Nero! <laughs> what a lovely surprise! Whoa, what are you doing here? Did your tree hose get wrecked too? This isn't about that explosion last week, right? It was an accident, I swear! I was just trying a new chemical compound that would change the color of my clothes! No. Oh, okay. But now that you've mentioned it, I'll have you file a little report once we return to Shang 2. Okay. We return? Don't tell me. The Magister has summoned you all for an audience. <sighs> I said don't tell me. The Magister wants to see us? But why? We're I wonder if that date on the calendar the it matches the system huh. date or if it's just yeah, automatically set to 13. Don't wanna? You did kind of crash our unscripted sleepover. It would be unwise of you to refuse. Right. We're going. Milo, what are you? Right? Okay, easy. You heard the lady. Watch this. Oh, oh, oh. Hold on a sec. Make that two reports. I'll meet you outside the gate. Gather supplies if you must, but make it quick. Let's really attached to the stump for some reason. She calls him Mr. Stumpy. He can't actually enter. She's blocking the door. So we got hub areas. Okay, that's interesting. I'm the local merchant around these parts, so I sell a couple of helpful items that'll tone down the difficulty for new adventurers. Using helpful items reduces the crystal bonus you receive at the end of a stage, so I suggest that you only use them if you need them. Oh, bot. Shop is the bottom option. Protects cause lingering water damage to enemies. Transforms all crystal flowers in the stage into life flowers. I don't have any of those things. Any of that currency. I'm guessing that's gold chunks. I get called in every month to patch things up around here. This place is literally falling apart. Yellow orb. I bring this little guy with me when I'm mining for gems. Earth orbs make nearby crystals drift towards you. Kind of like a magnet. Cyclone! Don't do today what you can do tomorrow. Juniper talks amazingly well for a bird, but she could still be a little hard to understand. She guides us on our path to master of the seven senses and control our bodies and our fates. The first five senses are physical, sight, touch, hearing, taste, and smell. The six and seven senses transmit the first five through space and time, respectively. The six sense is what some would call telepathy. Few can truly master it, especially with technology acting as a substitute. Have you ever been knocked out in battle and upon waking felt like you've already lived through future events? The seventh sense influences this feeling. It's the perception that what we are experiencing now is a vision from an infinite number of past selves we can learn from. Lore. Friend of Hound, hello. Friend is traveling. We have items very strong. Rabbit speaks of them. No rooms here. You could sleep in Hound Tree. Safe travel. Okay, so this is this is not where we need to go. You will travel to Shangtu Palace and meet with the Magister immediately. You put us in jail last you time. With proper reverence. I will not tolerate any flippancy. No worries, Lady Nira. Flippant. All right, wait. Okay. We have to turn it down. 
when, hold on, can I, uh, oh, inventory detail, what? These are collected at the end of each stage, take them to the battle sphere and machine to unlock boss rematches. Oh, okay, so these aren't unlockables anymore. Highly valuable gems that can be used to create and buy items. Like enough crystal outside stages can be fused into gold gems, okay. Records, Dragon Valley. Okay, so it looks like there's a... What is that, a door item? Citizens. Alicia, Juniper. A species plant. Badges, these are... What's happening? I can't actually move the cursor on this. There's a photo album. It's just photos I take. It's not photos you unlock. I thought there was, like, special art, but I guess not. Jukebox, that's pretty self-explanatory. There's a lot of music in this game, which is good, because the first game's music was really good. Uh, oh, wait. I wanted to go to settings. There we go. There we go. Now I can raise the volume of the game and have the voices be louder. And have everything else just kind of match up. Actually, I'm gonna... There we go. Shang 2. Oh, it's a separate map. Shenlin Park. <laughs> Make your way to the capital. Make sure you destroy everything on the way there. Back here again. Oh. Hey, can you all hear me through this thing? Four twenty, good buddy. That's not completely right, but cool. Oh wow! Am I on TV? <gasps> Hi, Mila. Hi, Mila. Cyclone. Quite no. Oh, so the checkpoints aren't even visible. They just happen when you pass a certain spot. That's interesting. Pet. I knew that obsession would come back to bite me in the ass at some point.
up some more. Okay. Oh, I have the water shield. Nice. That was what was in that blue, uh, that big square blue thing. Fire underwater. Wait, where are you guys going? She said not to do anything stupid. If we split up and help, we won't be getting in the way at all. Happened there. Oh, I didn't get hurt because I had the shield, but it's gone now. Okay, so yeah, they're definitely going for, like, double-length stages, which is why there's no axe in this game. Cyclone! These stages are pretty damn long. <laughs> One stage, yes, this whole city has been one stage. We are not, we, we, we've only done Dragon Valley so far, which looked way different, but it was Dragon Valley. I need those. Uh, okay. Uh, that's why I couldn't hurt this thing before. It's shit out bombs. Oh, 
Oh, those explosions uh, later. Cool. I like that they portray the boss's health in the same way that your health is uh, shown. The same kind of a. Uh, That's how it's done. The same kind of health bar. In the first game, I don't think there were any health bars for the enemies. Apparently, so, this was mentioned in the Direct, but, uh, the GoldenEye is coming to Switch Online. It's also getting an HD up res onto Xbox, but Xbox isn't getting online play in it, because, um, the Xbox version is just gonna be, like, a running, because it's just gonna be the, the you know, an, up, an updated ROM running, whereas the NSO has the online built into it, so it can do online play. But, I mean, it's really weird that they touted the online play on it, <laughs> because... If you've seen if you've seen the NSO N64 apps uh, online, it's it's not uh, it's not amazing. So give me one second. I want to check something. Okay. Nope. Never mind, we're good. Thought something weird happened, but nope, we're okay. Node? Why is there a node there? Oops. <laughs> the edge of that screen is very, uh, very easy to access. General Gong's got a great training dojo. He'll help you learn some more advanced techniques. Really weird that he's just here as a guard. Oh wait, no. That's not the same character I'm thinking of. I'm thinking of Torque. He's like, Duck? Wasn't he an alien? No. First day on the job and I got stuck with one of those uniforms made for Slim Bears. Figures. No pun intended, by the way. Don't forget your guard button. Timing's a little tricky, but it can deflect ta attacks with practice. I used to live next to Kiara, but she pulled out all my furniture and put it in her dollhouse. Why do kids have to be so giant? Hey, settling in. I know Shang 2 could be a pretty confusing city for you foreign types. Not that I'm saying you're stupid or anything, just that there's an adjustment period to our way of life. Here's my trading course. I'd love to show you around, but first the Magister wants to see you. Head to the Royal Palace on the eastern end of town to find him. Come back when you're done, I'll have some challenges waiting for you. The Spamton plush just dropped? Oh no. D do people know what he sounds like? I have to check. I have to look. I have to see this. See it.
Now it's actually your chance. $32. Eh. Then piercing workout body ready. Makes one of five sounds when you squeeze its head in. Requires three replaceable dump AAA batteries included. Due to its proportions, it can't stand upright without support. <laughs> uh, heaven piercing workout ready body. Designed by the classics you've come to expect. 1997. I don't think I'm in the market to buy that, but I, I want to hear what the sounds are that it makes. I really do. Cyclone! Yeah. Hey there, name's May. Studying the burgeoning new field of neuroscience. That's brain science, FYI. Over there's Dr. Tough Love. She's in bioengineering, which is all the synthetic flesh stuff. I'd ask if you were here about the research assistant position, but I mean, just look at your hands. I need tiny fingers, I said. Tiny children's fingers! Ahem. <clears throat> Sorry if I scared you. Dr. Tovlove says I need to work on my people skills. And my scientific research ethics. They got a new pin with spammed him in the dumpster. I, I, is that new? I thought that was never- Oh no. That's something else I'm thinking of. I'm in charge of fighting illnesses around these parts. Life pedals may protect us from serious physical injuries, but nobody's immune to the flu. Or COVID. Good to see some new faces around here. General's been spending more time with the mangy pup lately. Kinda jealous. A little bit of screen tearing, but we're okay. Ooh, look at this. Look at this dragon. I like that. Oh, the poses are different if you're in the air. He was in the last game. I'm in charge of the armor here. I also refine materials into gold gems, so feel free to bring me any you collect in the field. Sorry, I can't give you a weapon you haven't been trained to use. Besides, I've heard about your dragon boost, and it's probably stronger than anything we have. exchange. Gem exchange. Alright, so you need a lot of these to get a single core, which is weird because those items cost one each. So you can't... Uh, unless you can buy it once and then you have it permanently. Oh, um, Mother says if I have a wood shield, life petals will move towards me. Mmm, so yummy. <laughs> General Gong's got a great training dojo. I'll help you learn some more advanced techniques. It's been a while since I saw you. Welcome back. I tried telling people what you did to help us beat Brevin, but they don't listen. Don't worry, though. Everyone here in the palace knows your story. Also the part about you getting thrown in jail, but hey, that's still something. Good to see some new faces around here. Oh, wait, we were... It's the same people from the outside. Your Excellency. Welcome. We appreciate your attendance on such short notice. Why have you brought us here, O Exalted One? I am sure you are aware of the rise in creature attacks throughout Avalis. Our intelligence suggests that this is not a coincidence. However, their connection remains a mystery. We need capable fighters to counter the attacks and discover their origin. Assist us, and you will be graciously rewarded. What kind of reward are we talking about here? Wads of cash? A statue of yours truly? <gasps> a solid gold motorbike? Um, I think the motor would melt a solid gold bike. Wow. Way to crush my hopes and dreams into dust, Mila. Any gems you find on a mission are yours to keep. In addition, you may use the palace grounds as your base of operations. What? That's not a reward. That's just picking up loose change. That's cleanup duty. Carol, we need a place to stay. We can't just freeload off Mila. Besides, the money could help us rebuild our home. Is that what I'm going to have to collect well, gems for? You, Am I going to be Is there going to be like a subquest here? Crash our house and kick its big shiny metal butt. I'd like to help 
But, um, my laboratory. Our soldiers can transport all your equipment here easily. Oh, that'd be great. Just make sure they're wearing safety equipment. Have we reached an agreement? Ladies? Magister, we accept your offer. You render your world a great service. What do you look like under that robe? You performed great deeds in defense of our people, but that does not erase your past misconduct. Respect our laws and our judgment, and you will be fine. It's as simple as that. Should you have mission-specific questions, please consult Lieutenant Nero. While in the field, she will act as your direct liaison in defending Shang Tu. I thought I smelled water dragon. Hey, I've seen you around before. Aren't you an earth dragon? Not quite. Why don't you go make yourself useful? There's a Spanton shirt coming soon that looks cool. Interesting. I imagine we're going to be getting some some new a lot of a, a, a bit of new merch later this week on the 15th when the uh, anniversary happens. Or was today the anniversary? I thought September 15th was the the uh, Undertale anniversary. I like your shoes. Meet your colleagues. I'm laying low here till I hit the road again. Manager was nice enough to rent me one of the rooms in exchange for lavating up the place with tunes. If you find any vinyl, I could totally play. Totally, if you find any vinyl, I could totally play him back for you. All right. Hey, this place is a tavern, so why don't you grab a drink, pull up a chair, and sit down? Then we'll talk. Yo, what's up? What's up? Sorry, I was listening to music. Tundra Lilling's new album is pretty dope. Sure thing. Have a seat at the table over there and we'll serve up some drinks. New blood, huh? Reminds me when I first signed up. I got put through a ringer of a hazing that never seemed to end. I was cleaning the latrines every day. I had to work twice as hard to get to where I am. Hazing finally stopped, but the hate didn't. Too bad for them. I ain't going anywhere. <laughs> Buddy Naomi owns a record store in Shang Mu. You should check it out sometime. Our rooms are booked up, all three of them. We've been saying that for years that we need to expand, but they won't permit any more construction in the courtyard. My parents call Askel a mangy pup a lot, but not to his face. I don't think that's a nice word. Assistant May is studying neuroscience. Something about brains lights her up like a kingdom stone. Slenderness in pandas happens to be happens because we don't need to hibernate, so we're free to pursue a diet. It works best for our job. I just realized if you if they have a light bulb, they still haven't said everything. Keep mixing me up with the other guy. I don't see the resemblance. Oh, is he talking about, uh, Torque? This knee of mine keeps me from proper field work, but I'll support you from the sidelines. Hi, welcome to El Laboratorio de Mila. By the awesome power of science, I make potions to help out in our missions. This is your jumping power. This is your maximum number of life petals by one. This is your maximum running speed on flat ground. You want the stage with additional stocks. 
for the life pills from reviving. Reduces the number of crystals you need for a stock. Max life up. Oh! Yeah, once you have it, it's obtained. So they're permanent. This here's my training course. I've got a bunch of challenges to test your skills. Heck, if you think you're ready, you can even meet, battle me or your buddies in a sparring match. What do you say? Destroy all targets to advance the next round. Clear 10 rounds as fast as you can. New set of targets appears every 3 seconds. Destroy 30 targets as fast as you can. Earn points by avoiding the ball. Successful guards give you an extra additional points. Earn 1,000 points as fast as you can. Let's give it a shot. Pressure jumps. New set of targets appears every three seconds. Destroy 30 as fast as you can. Okay. Pressure's on now. Bow. You can't hit them back. That noise is uh, very weird. Morning workout. Let's spar. Oh, you could fight against other people. Ah! 
not as easy as it looks. Zero of four? What does that mean? Hmm. <laughs> wow, this is hard as fuck. Oh, I see. Your lives are tied to your retries instead of a checkpoint. Defeated. That burst is actually really helpful. That's how it's done. Excellent. Oh, I need to beat four before I could fight him, that's it. Dragon boost Stay finish. Classy. Nice. in the first game? I think she was. I remember the stabby ice bits. Oh, 
There we go. That's how you time that. Oh, now he's got both of them bouncing around at once. Got him. That's how it's done. Ah, oh, but reviving lowers your rank, I guess. Whatever. Oh god, look at his health. Who is this? Who is this mysterious fellow? I suppose we will find out. Never. Or maybe we will. I don't know. Fuck if I know. Alright, wait. So I want to see. I just want to check here. Max life up one. Bought it. Sky Pirate Panic, enter the Battle Sphere, Mystery of the Frozen North. Ooh. Once you start an episode, you must complete it before you move. You can select a new one. Okay. Interesting. So it's a little open ended. No, the hologram maker from the first game. It has been purloined. Avian Museum. Ooh, I like the sound of that already. There's been an attack on the museum. The culprit stole Pangu. Pangu no, no. contains an extensive database of our history and culture. Much of its knowledge has yet to be deciphered. It must be recovered at all costs. Increase your maximum amount of life pedals by one. Bonus none. Used. Oh, 
Oh, item sets, okay. So you could have multiple sets. So I could choose that, or I could just go to no- okay, so it's a quick set. Alright. I'm gonna try to do this without items, so... Let's not worry about it. Bouncy burb. There we go. Boink. Cyclone. Not bouncy enough though. There we go. Oh, okay. The further distance you go with that, the more points you get. I thought it was like a thing for killing enemies. <laughs> I was like trying to rush to find an enemy and I'm like, there's nothing here. those things to like refill over half your health. It was like that in the first game too though.
double hit there. <laughs> Suddenly, Cyber Peacock. No, actually, this reminds me of the museum from X6. Ground Scaravich. Look at this. We got Yoku blocks. Or Roku blocks. Yomi blocks? I forget what they're called. Okay, now that actually doesn't hurt you. That's nice. Her house, too. This situation needs a more delicate touch. This is for trashing our house, you jerk! Cyclone! I've noticed there's no health refills during battles anymore, though. Um, a thing that the first game did a lot of. It, it would drop health refills during fights. One hit left. Stay classy. Oh, it's that dude from the opening. Hey, you've got some explaining to do, mister. Who are you? Why did you destroy my home? 
You broke my buddy! My friend! How could you? We were just having fun! That's what we felt like when you broke Your our name's, house! Uh... Doesn't feel so good, does it? Do you even know how long it took to fix the microsensor bracket? I installed a high fidelity amplifier so I could eliminate all the IR interference and use it right from the control pad! And it had a flush mount and a high data IR flush mount? and a microsensor audio and wide angle reception and a bicolor light too! And I could even use it in the sun because usually IR interference is unbearable! <sighs> okay. What they, just happened? They've zonked. They've zonked out. Lilac here. Mission accomplished. The culprit is incapacitated. You fool! What are you still doing there? The thieves are getting away in their airship. What? I only found that out like right now. Enough. Head to the seaport immediately. Move out. <laughs> Dummy, 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 dummy! You fell for it! Hey, get back here! I mean, same. Ah, this is how I feel about life. Gallery? Cyclops! Hi, I'm Sammy. Welcome to the gallery. Oh wait, I'm sorry, Master says that you're banned. A significant number of exhibits were destroyed by all those robots. If you have us pay for new exhibits, I'm sure he'll let you back in. How? The doors in the main hall lead to different galleries ready for new exhibits. Most of the doors will lock at first, but we'll open more galleries later. We place signs next to the exhibits you can donate to. We accept a variety of currencies, including cores, crystals, and gold gems. When all the exhibits in a room are constructed, we'll build a perfect replica of the specimen. Woke up thinking, ah, Bo, today's going to be a wonderful day. And then my museum got blown up by Sky Pirates. You are banned for life, you hear me? You're under Tarsier, friend. Banned! I might let you back in if you pay for all the damage you caused, but I doubt a reprobate like yourself could ever afford it. What do you mean, how? Donations! There's signs all over the place for them. Get going! Watch your back. Oh, people in their judicious roughhousing. Oh, is this how you do boss refights? This exhibit is down for maintenance. Cyclone! Winston's Confections, a staple of every cornerstone in Avalis. Some would say running a candy factory is a dream job, but they haven't seen what I've seen. It's best not to think about what you've been through to bring the gift of candy to everyone. Just know that in the end, the struggles I faced make it all the sweeter. Oh, I can't have my stream thing up while I'm doing this. Also, I'm dropping frames? Oh. That's upsetting. I didn't realize I was dropping so many of them. Oh, well, whatever. I'm not going to stop now. Though dropping 2% of eight, almost 3% of my stream is uh not good. Hey, are you the one who wrecked the museum? If so, thanks. Not that he's mad at someone else, the amount of side eye I get from Sourface McSourton has practically dropped to zero. I can't even remember the last time he called me a loitering layabout. Art restoration. I guess these aren't the refights. Watch where you're going, young lady.
you need a lot of parts to reassemble some of these. Clear. Interesting concept, but it sounds like it's gonna be a lot of grinding to do everything. Quick shop. One more. Thank you. This is your jumping power. This is your maximum running speed on flat ground. This is the number of hits your elemental shields can absorb. That's interesting. How does this work exactly? Four units gives you an extra stock. You don't get more, so so once you have it, you have it. Even for those. That's interesting though. Airship Siguada. Okay, so each of these are gonna be different, uh a set of different stages. Okay. So each story is more than one. Cool, cool, cool. Yoshi's Island Spinners. Punchy Mantises. Oh no. Last time we had rolly ones, now we have punchy ones. Oh my god, speaking of fist, what about... <laughs> I have to watch people's reaction to that Fist of the North Star fitness game. Fitness of the North Star. It's just such a bizarre... Like, I love it, I love the idea of it, but it's such a bizarre concept. A lot of burbs in this game. Very Gunstar Heroes ish, the way some of these sprites move.
one? I think I did. Oh, I see. I have to go get it from the other side and push it over here. If you have a shield active already, it gives you more more uh, protection. Even if it's a different shield. Like she's been deactivated. Whoa there! Throttle back, Tiger. <laughs> Let's count. Hey you! What do you think you're doing Wait, with our count. robot? Let me bring you up to speed. Cortison. The name's Corazon, captain of the Sigwada and mercenary extraordinaire. In the flesh. That Pengu of yours is a real sweet piece of hardware. You stole it from Perusa. We're here to steal it back. I don't know what you're talking about, but there's no way you're keeping her after what you've done. I figured you'd say that. Then it's time to kick the tires and light the fires! Coming at you, Speedy! Cyclone. Oh, she's absolutely related to Carol. Huh! <laughs> 
used to get the level just ending when you beat the boss. <laughs> Pretty impressive. I actually got a little beat it up. Beat it. The mastermind, I presume. Doesn't she look familiar? Hey guys, kept you waiting, huh? What the heck, Cory? Carol? Is that you? Well, ain't this a Charlie Fox trot of a situation? Sorry, sis. Another time. Cory! After her! Nah. A decoy. <laughs> Clever. I must reluctantly agree. For a wildcat. But look! Pango's back! Yay! I guess that's something to celebrate. Carol, was that... Was that your sister? Yeah, honestly, I'm totally weirded out right now, so... Sister or not, this was an attempted robbery of a major historical artifact on Shengtuzian soil. Airspace. Both. The Magister will hear of this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The ports have been ghosted, milady. Excellent. And the Pangu drone? Too much downtown action. We had to jink out of there pronto. Unfortunate. Remember, feline, I cannot guarantee the safety of you or your family unless you have properly fulfilled your duties. Yes, milady. The drone will be ours, eventually. It is only a matter of time. But who is this woman? Who is this Aqualash? Lash? Lash? Location. Good evening, sir. Hey, the museum got trashed, so this place is your new home for now. Location set as home. Now turn into a dragon! Invalid command. Sorry, kid. Her dragon mode had to go. Didn't want to scare the museum staff in case someone accidentally messed with it. And we didn't want to have to redo it in this game's style, I'm totally so... I'm okay with that. I'd hate to fight that thing again. Though, well, I kind of miss writing it. I've informed the Magister of today's events. That woman is now on the official terror watch list for all of Shang 2. That's... probably for the best? For the best? That's my sister we're talking about! The watch list is designed with the safety of Shang 2 and its citizens in mind. Your frankly nebulous familial ties don't even come into it. Uh, whatever. In other words, suck it up, Buttercup. Okay. Can't believe our ports got hammered by Sivwada. Those Sky Pirates mostly operated from Perusa. Pengu must have been real important for them to come this far. I'd steer clear of the museum for a while if I were you. Or the curator holds a mean grudge. Oh, look! Mmm. Yeah, but we lost the ports in one little airship attack. Feels humiliating, honestly. Humiliating, honestly. Still managed to pull one over the mangy pup, so I got something good out of this, at least. I'm not thrilled at the damage caused to the museum's exhibits. Neither is the owner. Suppose it was unavoidable, all things considered. You consider contributing a few gems towards rebuilding the process. Towards the rebuilding process, excuse me. In hindsight, perhaps we should have secured Pangu within the confines of the palace. Nevertheless, I believe having such a rare artifact be available for public viewing to be important. Bonk. So, this is gonna sound weird, but that airship lady is kinda cute. I mean, yeah, no, what she did is terrible, and uh, busting up museums no one goes to is bad. The favorite part of the museum was all the flowers. All those dried flowers all lined up in the glass boxes. And just across from there were the butterflies, pinned to boards, forever staring at the blossoms they cannot touch. <laughs> Exquisite. Our naval fleet's in shambles thanks to the Sky Pirate. That we build the shipyards from scratch. Don't worry, our forces may be down to half strength, but Shang Tu will be protected. Mind control is the cooler kid in the medical block. 
and I'm the hot gr goss teen reporter re ready to throw down and get the scoop. Do scientific inquiry and experimentation. All I need are brains to study, I mean. Gotta find me some fresh heads to crack open and scramble around those squishy insides. Ugh. I've asked the guards if anyone wants to donate their brains to science. No takers yet. Maybe some kind of financial incentive is needed, hmm? How would you help get Pangu back? That's excellent. Machines like that are the reason I got into bioengineering. One of my colleagues at the Institute helped reverse engineer Pangu's technology. Among other things, it helped us upgrade the equipment in this palace. I haven't seen Cory in years. She told me to stay out of trouble, but now she's the one on Shang 2's most wanted list. Also, hey, I can't believe you didn't have my back with the scary lady. Cory's not a bad guy, she's my sister. Nerve of those sky pirates destroying our cultural heritage, our history. I bet they came from Peru's of those lazy roustabouts. Oh, Pengu hologram. Never mind. Can we fight the dragon? Oh no, it's a hologram of me. Use the guard. I keep forgetting I have it. First enemy. Nice. And sparring, buddy. They're popping up on Steam before the actual uh, game puts them up. Cool. Well, that's all of them. And it doesn't save the rank, so... Yeah, I guess that's all, all of it. A lot less training than uh, the first game. But more varied. More variables. So you beat up a kid genius inside a gooey center, and then we find out there are two carols? A robot with a kid genius inside its gooey center. Our lives are strange. Hope the little guy's okay. Maybe we shouldn't have broken his friend. I have one of these. It'll cost three. Your physical attacks absorb life from enemies. Oh, that's definitely helpful. If I get into a really tight spot, I might use that. Oh, there's nothing that only costs one left here. Okay. I thought I knew what I was signed up for, but I got sh getting shot by, by an airship and nearly drowning was definitely not on the list. Join the Royal Army, they said. Open yourself up to new experiences, they said. Well, I guess they weren't wrong. Clear. Can I pick it again? No, you can't. Enter the Battle Sphere. Have you seen Carol? Yeah! She said she was going to Shang Mu to buy ice cream for everyone! Isn't she the best? Uh-huh. Sure. Let's just check on her super quick. Uh, Carol? Why are you going to Shang Mu? Battle Sphere, gonna fight, gonna get me some grand prizes! Whoa, whoa, whoa! What now? What about, you know, our missions from the Magister? Can't talk! Robot smashy time! <sighs> Nira's gonna kill us. Do you hate Mondays like we do? Yes. Then come on down to the Battle Sphere for Mayhem Monday! Looks like Taba <laughs> from Breath of the Wild. Brigade. And don't forget about our knuckle-busting Battle Royale! Where fighters from all around the globe do get out for a chance to win the grand prize! Are you a bad enough dude to survive the Battle Sphere? Are you'll face me, Captain Collab. What is with all? I, I love how many birds are in here. It must be 13. Nice. This advertisement is brought to you by Mayor Zhao and Zhao Entertainment Corporation. Grand prizes are subject to change at the discretion of Mayor Zhao at any time and are non-negotiable. All entrance fees are non-refundable. Enter now. Must be 13 or older to enter. Feline mind. I wouldn't underestimate Carol the Wildcat. 
<gasps> oh, do you think that would be your stage name? That would be so cool. Go after her if you wish. I have better things to do. Wait, didn't you say you were looking for more fighters? A solid idea. The Gong and I had already considered it. The champion had no interest in our battles. Something about the Red Wing of Justice will not be drafted into military service. <laughs> that was very good. Thank you. But you do want his help, right? So what if we go to the Battle Sphere and win? Then he'll have to reconsider. The logic is flawless. It'll be fun. I'm going to enter as Aleem, the mask and Murata with a mysterious past. I would like to know if the robots in there are related to the ones we've been fighting. I suppose this is worth our attention. That's the spirit! Alright, it's fight night. Phoenix Highway. This game rips. Not gonna lie. NGL, this game's awesome. <laughs> what? Oh. Screw. Cyclone! What does that do? Stop sticking to the wall. Okay, you can't control that, that's automatic. It just takes you wherever it needs you to be. Cyclone! No, 
Oh wait, I need There's a chest over there. Cyclone. Wait. Uh, yeah. Yes. Found a brave stone. Okay, don't know what that does, but I got it. <laughs> somewhere. Oh, up there. Okay, it is that. easy. Nice, though. Pretty good. Guardless run. I keep forgetting guard exists. I'm surprised I didn't get that sooner. Shang Mu. So what's... Shang Tu. Okay. Oh, right. That's where the, the, the short emperor who likes uh, doing, like, RPG stats on himself. If you see if you saw the first game, it would make a lot more sense. While this was an unexpected deviation, this diversion gives us an opportunity to confirm our neighbor's strength. We are all in this together, after all. Have fun storming the battle sphere! <laughs> uh, takes me back. Going into the battle sphere. Wow, this is just like last night. <laughs> really weird how similar this is feeling to, uh, to Forgotten uh, Fallen Star. Yeah, 
batter up. Batter down. Ow. Oh, there's a bat. Okay, I see what I'm doing. Nope, oh, wrong button. down. Break the balloons! It makes so much sense. I saw one of those earlier in the stage, and I'm like, is there a point to that? I feel like that was gonna be a little too easy. No health left. One hit away from doing that without dying, too. That's how it's done. Dragon Runner.
I can't. That was weird. Why did it do that? Basically, just part time as Lilac. Uh, complete all training challenges in Gong's Dojo. Defeat your own character in combat. Defeat all sparring opponents in Gong's Dojo. Talk to every citizen in the Royal Palace. Take a photograph. Defeat a boss at Lilac's Dragon Boost. Obtain a gold gem by exchanging crystals. Cores. Store an exhibit in the gallery. Clear stage without using the guard button. Alright. We did it. Oh, this is a hub area. This isn't even a full uh, stage. I drew a picture. Look at it. That's uh, that's something, all right. Snakes are dumb. I think you and I are gonna be good friends. No funny business, unless you're one of the battle clowns. In that case, the suspension of humor would be acceptable. Acrobell. The various antics of the battle clowns are most agreeable. We all enjoy a good laugh, professionally, of course. Thunder Luling. Oh, that's the singer. Lilac. This guy's name is Rootbeer. Lilac, what brings you back to these parts? You ever feel like going on another wacky adventure with the red scars? We're not far away. Cafe 64. There's some sandwiches for sale here. Fruit juice, too. The whole thing with the museum and Shang Tzu seaports wouldn't have happened under my watch. That's the trouble with Sa Shang Tzuans. Way too soft. Give him a couple days with Shang Mu's number one patrol guard. I'll whip them in shape. I like how she leans down to talk to him. My father was a demon king with three eyes. He killed my mom and sister and then gave me his power so I could do his bidding. But I said no and he banished me. Hey there, welcome to the Silver Lotus Express, some of Shang Mu's finest homemade noodles. Like in Balthazar's Bazaar. Hey, you? Yeah, you. Think you're a true warrior? Now's your chance to prove it. We've purchased a few, procured a few artifacts that will truly test your might on the battlefield. Brave stones, ready to roll. For a small fee, of course. If you're skilled enough to clear stages with them, you'll easily earn back the cost. One hit KO, you always have an empty life meter. Ugh. Every 30 seconds your life meter alternates between fully restored and completely drained. All item containers are transformed into bombs. That's that sounds amazing, but I don't want to I don't want to get that. Then again, I could clear the shop out now if I want to. Life Oscillation seems funny, but I don't think I had the stones to use it. What do you mean, have we ever used them? Of course we have, inside our house, with the doors and windows locked where it's safe. Hey, what'd I tell you? No, going, no getting soft in front of the customers. Sorry. The Daybreakers are much cooler than those edgy red scarf buffoons. For one thing, we actually follow the law. Nothing's cooler than that. Eh, that sounds kind of lame to me. I'm Marion Note with Tri Kingdom News, Evolus's number one news network. I remember some Chiron documentaries as Aliens, The Maniacs Who Blew It Up, and Magnificent, the 100 best hair salons for canines. Hey, weren't you one of those kids that got thrown into a Shang Tu prison? We should do an interview about that sometime. People person. Stadium food, am I right? Hi, I'm Pommy. I'm Manny the Galaxy Trail booth here. Or I was supposed to, but there's all that plywood and paint, so I'm kind of just loafing around now. Anyway, thanks for playing so far. That's Sean's character. Oh, it's, it's, it goes around the circle. Okay. Wait, four, three. Uh... Carol, wait up! Lilac, um, hi. How's it going? What were you thinking? You shouldn't have run off without us. I don't need a babysitter, okay? I can handle myself. That's not the point and not at all what I meant. We want a battle sphere too! Yeah. If we're gonna fight in the battle sphere, then we're gonna do it together. As a team. Awesome! Looks like the old Carol charm is finally rubbing off on you guys. 
Even you, scary lady. Mm -hmm. Don't flatter yourself. I'm here to recruit the champion to our cause. And to help you. You are clearly doomed to fail without our support. Gee, thanks for the vote of confidence. It's very confusing because it doesn't move. Because you go around to the other side. Which is expected, but weird. Hey there, welcome to the vinyl venue. I guarantee you'll find something to fit your groove. Play the song with the jukebox. Or okay, so you can spend music. Oh my god, look how many there are. It's a lot of songs. Why are you talking to me? I'm not really that important. What can I do for you today? Do you have an appointment? Would you like me to trim those ponytails of yours? No! I mean, no thank you. Sorry. No, well allow me to leave you with a small perusin... Perusin sal... Sal... Ugh. No, well allow me to leave you with a small perusin sal... Cane. A sleeping crustacean gets carried away by the current. Basically, you snooze, you lose. Cyclone! Hey, I got my eye on you. I think it escapes the gaze of shang -Mu's number one patrol guard. Weapon is a guitar sword made from the bones of dead behemoths. It can summon shadow clones to fight for me. A dimensional rift in my left eye that gives it a rainbow color. I'd show you, but unfortunately it destroys anyone who looks at it. Keep walking. Before I arrest you for obstruction of a police officer and the execution of their duties. Ugh. My mouth is going pretty mushy right now. Oh, the thing went away. Battles for your time. Can't wait to see Captain Kala. I know his theme song by heart. Da 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 I don't know. I don't know what tune he's singing there. The only prizes in the crane game are Captain Kala action figures. Captain Kala Quest 2 came out a few weeks ago. It's pretty good. The shooting levels take forever though. Why don't they just stick to class and beat him up action of the first Kala Quest? Driving game only seems to work if there are four players. It's the same strength test as the one in Zhao Land, but smaller. Stay the art dance now machine. Groovy. Looks like this game is playable. Say what now? Fist of Frog. Press jump for new game, press start for options. Fist of Frog! Say what now? Ah, okay. I got it. Two. Old arcade games like this always cheat. Okay, you need a launch for that to work. <laughs>
Nice. My dear, is that you? you? look different today. No, I'm not her. Oh, I'm sorry, young lady. I may need a pair of glasses sometime soon. Yes, it's me. I appreciate the tension, but shouldn't you be making friends your own age, my dear? Cyclone! The fur dye in Kiki's salon is amazing. Bet you thought that blue was my natural fur color, huh? remember my shades next time I'm out in the sunrise. Last time I couldn't see a thing and got lost. Before you even start, yes, I've heard all about the blindest bat jokes before. Keep them to yourself. Anyone says Captain Colossus, the hottest fighter, clearly wasn't around when Jade Fury took the stage. How does he keep his fur so glossy and perfect? the president of the Battlesphere fan club, also known as the BFC. We've got members from all over Avalos and even a couple in Perusa. You going to enter? That's so cool. We hardly see any girls in there. It'd be nice to see us ladies taking butt and kicking names. Erm, um, you know what I mean. I'm just glad nobody got seriously hurt in the attack on the museum. That's the most important thing. Oh, not that I'm saying the destruction of priceless artifacts is not important. Those are very important too. S super important. Oh, yeah, you have to be invited to go in there. It's where all the famous people hang out, so they don't get swarmed by fans. Cyclone! I've been training every day since I busted my knee. Almost ready to take on the champ again. Knee injuries are pretty common in the battle sphere. I'd wear some guard pads if I were you. Part of the maintenance crew, we keep Zhao's battle bots in top shape. Bet you have any materials to spare, I'll gladly change you some gold gems for them. Oh, cool. Beginner's Gauntlet. Our next contestant is a water dragon. Now there's something you don't see every day. Oh, this is a stage, okay. Thought that was gonna be like an actual like battle thing. Style great there. It's pretty easy when you could fly over half the stage. Battle bot, battle royale. Ah, 
I'm hurt for the second time, right? No, I don't. Oh, those things. Those are the things that shoot the big, uh, echoey circles in the first game. So what now? Whoa! Looks like somebody didn't get the memo. Only the last fighter standing can ultimately face the champion of the battle sphere. Oh, right. Well, let's just let Carol do it then. Because if it does, I don't like what it means. Yeah, we don't have to do it. All right. Here's the plan. You guys take the fall, and I'll take on the champ. Yeah, sure. You have done well to come this far, but facing the champion is my responsibility. What? You don't think I can handle this? Guess we're going to have to settle this the hard way, huh? Oh, I've been waiting a long time for this! Do we really all have to fight each other? Hero Battle Royale, yep. Just let them take out each other. I still I got hit by that thing, even though I dodged it. I still managed to get right in its, in its line of uh, fire. I, I thought there was gonna be. I, I like. I almost. I'm almost certain there's a badge for beating all three of them. That was awesome. Let's do it again. I'm okay. Don't worry about me. You did great. Do not foul this up. Ladies and gentlemen, the self-proclaimed defender of the defenseless, the Red Wing of Justice, our very own champion of the Battle Sphere, Captain Collapse! Captain Kalau, I presume? You're a hard person to get a hold of, you know that? You have fought well, citizen. I, Captain Kalau, acknowledge your fortitude. I am honored, Captain, and would like to extend to you an invitation. Shang Tu is besieged by war machines and needs stalwart heroes to defend it. Please, in the name of justice, help us protect our city. <laughs> Is that so? Very well. I will make time to listen to your intriguing offer. Once first, I dare you to face one final challenge. That's, That's right, right, folks. The champion, the champion himself will decide what a contestant's final challenge will be. What? Did it actually be any of those? Race. This calls for a race. Really? You do know who I am, right? <laughs> I assure you, citizen, you'll need more than a nice pair of boots to keep up with me. Reach the goal line before Captain Kalata win this challenge. Good luck.
It's like a Sonic 3 uh, competition stage. Perfect run. Nice. I don't believe what I'm seeing, folks! Our newcomer has beaten Captain Kalau's challenge! Uh, I have tasted defeat! Victory is yours! Okay, so now that you're done being overdramatic, can we please have a serious talk about you helping us? We could use your help protecting our kingdoms. Very well. My people will review your request and pertinent details, but first, I would tend to some unresolved matters. I will message you once I'm done. You have my word. Thank you for your time, sir. Here to present the grand prize for the Battle Royale is the honorable, handsome, and highly humble leader of our fair city, our very own Mayor! Thank you, everyone! Thank you! <clears throat> Allow me to present the grand prize! Everyone stand back! This is going to be good! Coupon for free Taco Bell. For you wow. and five of your friends to dine at City Hall in glorious downtown Shangmu. I, I was joking and I ended up being right. Thank you, Mayor Zhao. <laughs> what an honor. I suppose I could use a free hot meal. Hot meal? It's funny because you... I know. Hilarious. Glorious. Thank you all for competing. See you next time. No refund, seriously. You were right about those fighters. Shang Tu breeds them tough, I'll grant them that. But they're nothing that the captain can't handle at full strength. Good. But I have no intention of underestimating them. Hmm. Nothing can be left to chance. Not this time. Not this time. <laughs> Did you get me my Taco so Bell? Awesome. No, I lost. Oh. Except for the part where we didn't win anything. That was stupid. Look on the bright side. We got the captain's attention. And we can eat at Mayor Zell's mansion whenever we want! Yeah, I guess. And Captain Kalau to join the fight might be more trouble than it's worth. His lawyers just send over a contract the size of a textbook. Battlesphere, huh? <laughs> that takes me back. Jade Fury is what they used to call me. Then I took an explosive cannon round to the knee. Oh, come on. It's funny because there's actually an arrow in the background right behind Nira. The diversion has gifted us a useful ally, but understand this. Future deviations from our mission will not be so easily forgiven. I found that cursed theme song. Driving me to distraction. I confess that while I find the entertainment value of the battle to be of dubious quality, I cannot deny its mass appeal, nor its catchy theme songs. Time capsules, Kingdom Stone. This is our final message. A message that we leave for the future. Although we will respect the wishes of your people and allow our influence to pass into legend, there will come a time in your history when you must learn the truth. Hmm. When we were stranded here, we sought desperately to return to our world. We wasted countless years trying to find a way home. But we are no closer to an answer than when we started. We decided that helping your civilization survive and prosper was a more efficient use of our 
technology. We have condensed our energy reserves into a physical relic of extraordinary power. Do not eat With it. With proper care, you may one day use it to travel to the stars, to find the answers that we alone could never find. If you wish to know more, you'll have to access our internal database. I pray that it is still intact by the time you receive this message. May the winds of time carry you for eternity. Mm-hmm. Three years have passed since the invasion that almost destroyed our world of Avalis. Revan, the intergalactic warlord, had planned to steal the Kingdom Stone, source of energy for all our world's technology. With the help of Lilac, the Water Dragon Warrior, and her friends, we drove back our alien attackers. But the scars of war remain. The Kingdom Stone has been shattered, its fragments scattered into the very air around us. Remnants of the alien attack force haunt us still, striking us at our most vulnerable, leaving us in a perpetual state of turmoil. The world of Avalis needs hope. But more than that, it needs heroes. Okay. Not a big fan of the music stopping whenever the menus are up. Adding another bird to Shang Tzu's defense force. Great, it'll be good to see more beaks around here. Stones, I hope people don't start thinking I look like him as well. Even I get a little confused sometimes now. Yeah. I don't know why wildcats are green. Camouflage. They could easily hide in the jungle floor of their homeland in Perusa. Let a water dragon into battle sphere? Don't you think that's a bit too much? I mean, sure, it pulls good viewer numbers or whatever, but that shouldn't be what the battle sphere is about, no? Why, are you salty? I think you're salty. You know, it would be cool and better than robot cleanup duty forever. Battle sphere. Come on, just for a little bit, please? It's a shiny gold trophy with my name on it. And we found out you guys were Battlesphere, and I tuned in I tuned the screens in so the whole tavern could watch. Battlesphere, huh? Always wanted to try out for that. Couldn't get a lock in on the account of my Earth Dragon Blood giving me an unvantage, unfair advantage. Couldn't get a look in on account of my Earth Dragon Blood giving me an unfair advantage. When I said I was only half Earth Dragon, I got the nastiest side eye. I'm told, and told, well, that would explain your looks. <laughs> got me coming and going. Atmosphere was nice, and we made a new friend, and got free dinner at Mayor Zhao's. I declare this mission a huge success. Just need to get a proper mask for my battle sona. Maybe a cape, too? Ponder. Oh, I could get another. I could exchange more. I thought about trying out for the Battle Sphere at some point, but it turned out the requirements were even more strict than getting into the Royal Army. Also, I had to sign a waiver for sustaining surgically catastrophic knee injuries in the Battle Sphere. It seemed a bit suspect, so I bugged out. Mystery of the Frozen North. Is that a potion? It is. Oh, 
Oh, where am I supposed to go? You don't have the required currency for this exhibit. Bosses in this game, at least. Trouble for Winston's confections began from the very first day. The money raised from my short lived political career in Shang Mu was supposed to go towards the building that magnificent. Ugh. The money raised from my short lived political career in Shang Mu was supposed to go towards building that magnificent candy factory. Turned out that Bernstein, my chief accountant, had been skimming funds and absconded with the stolen money. Last anyone saw of him, he was on a ferry over to Perusa with a young lady on his arm. sketched Acrobelle during her fights in the Battle Sphere, but having her own exhibit here would make things so much easier. Her attack pies look so delicious and yet deadly. Is it the cream? Or the filling? I guess we'll never know. Oh, this is the train. This will give you a lot of stuff to spend the money on. Oh, this is just a regular- okay, that's just a regular chest. supposed to go We gong. I didn't see that. Uh, people are gonna miss that. I think they're gonna have to. I think people are gonna say that this has to be more noticeable. Tiger Falls. King Dale of Shui Gong is asking for our help. Apparently, they need to track down a thief that's been stealing weapons. Shui Gong has become a close ally. It would be our honor to assist them in their time of need. Yeah, why not? <laughs> We need a plot point here, so why not? Cyclone! How am I doing on frame drops, by the way? I haven't checked in a while. Terrible. Oh my god. 
don't think there's a lot I could do about it right now. Yeah, the, the choppiness you're seeing on stream, that's not me. That's that's the stream quality, just being crap right now. Cyclone! I do think that my pro, my pro controller might actually be wearing out, because I'm noticing the weird miss inputs are like happening in every game I play now. So I think my B my B button might be getting worn out a bit. As is the right stick, unfortunately. I've seen Switch Pro Controllers go on sale right lately though, so I might pick up another one at some point. Just to make this a little less uh, frustrating to deal with. Oh. Ooh, this is cool. In the background. And yet I can still grab crystals from the foreground. Cyclone! Yep. Made the fool. Okay.
gonna get it like a maze now. Some wacky shit like that. Stone. Nice. What exactly do those do? Because the brave stones were what they mentioned in that shop as well. Does that mean I could buy another challenge artifact from that one shop? Uh oh, marble gardening. is going to use this mechanic somehow. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is interestingly challenging and clever. But you can still get hit in the background. But you can also hit them as well. It's something they establish pretty quickly. Checkpoint. Buster. Too shabby. Mm -hmm. There's my card though. Where's the damn card? Woo! There it is. <laughs> it's the exit button, so I can't leave without it.
Shui Gang Palace. Amazing! You, my friend, you are art! Your exquisite physical form is surely a divine gift bestowed by the Kingdom Stone itself. I would ask you for him to model for me like one of my Perusian girls, but alas, my current masterpiece yet awaits my attention. Tragedy! Think of all those museum exhibits in Shang Tu defiled by vulgar hands. No, I cannot! Such tumultuous thoughts ruin my artistic process. Away with ye, foul torments! Must be one of Gong's friends. It's so nice to see him make it in the world. Ever since that alien attack, he's been the talk of the town. You went to the Battle Sphere, right? Did you go to the VIP lounge? Was Th Thunder Lilling there? Tell me everything. Was she as beautiful as the first gentle snowfall of winter? With the cold snap of frost that is her inner strength and will that can only be expressed in song? I bet she smells nice too. <laughs> Nothing could stop General Gong. Not even aliens from outer space. I think you're super neat and cool. Okay, bye. Hi. I love all Thunder Lilling's songs by heart. Never gonna start as my favorite. They also really like Passive Aggressive and Wrong Turn. And Gentle Monkey. Ah, I can't decide. Ain't pretty cool if I can announce her Battle Sphere someday. Igor's my inspiration. Battle Sphere champions may rise and fall, but it's Igor's voice that ushers them on and off stage. Oh, you're a water dragon. I've never seen one before. That's not weird, is it? Sorry if I'm being rude. <laughs> Magnificent battle sphere in my child. Goodness me, but I haven't seen a debut like that since Gong's day. I'm sure it was his battle sphere performance that convinced the Magister to recruit him as well. So who knows what the future will bring for you? Gong used to train the palace with our king. The boy couldn't swing a sword straight no matter how hard he tried. Then he picked up the shield, and the rest of my child is history. It's so nice having a food market right across the street. People keep saying the fruit isn't as big as down south, but I think it's perfectly proportioned. Proportioned, excuse me. Not proportioned. So the Avon Museum is looking for donations? They'll get my crystals as soon as they finish building those viewing platforms for mice and mouse-sized folk. Staring up at the exhibits from ground level is a real pain in the neck, let me tell you. Wouldn't mind going to the Battle Sphere, but last time I went, they mistook me for a contestant. I almost got crushed by a robot pitcher. Pass. Ever since General Gong ordered that alien invasion, I've been eager to write about his exploits in my book. Ah, oh, what luck to be alive at such story times. Hey. 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 Quiet all of a sudden. Hey. Cyclone! Chloe's here and she's got the gear. Chloe will need compensation, of course, in the form of shiny gold gems. But if you got them, Chloe's goods are well worth the price. Increases the damage of your physical attacks. Cheaper stocks. I already have that. She sells the same items that some of the other shops sell. the Daybreakers, we welcome you to our quaint little town. Daybreakers, we provided spirits, spirited souls with honest work. It's quite similar to what the Magister does with his hirelings, except we're much more relaxed in our criteria. I hate getting junk mail from Shang Mu. I have to appreciate them printing it in small enough to fit in our mailboxes. That's dedication for ya. We have good synergy with the big folk. They help us build and fix our homes, and we agree not to live in the holes in their walls. Art! I'm positively entranced by the energy exuding from this piece. Simply divine! To honor the memory of the fallen princess who fought for peace in the War of Dragons. It is my duty! Huh? 
Well, that's interesting. Cyclone! So there's two exits. You could just walk to the left, or you could use the boat. <laughs> silly. Very silly. I know you were visiting after Battlesphere to brew some nice popping, uh, piping hot Lao Hao and Guao tea. I misspelled, mispronounced that. Holy shit. It's a naturally sweet tea that boosts your strength and endurance. Something you definitely need as a Battlesphere athlete. Battlesphere is a great place to scope out the latest in weapons tech. A clown bot that throws deadly cream pies? Awesome. A lot of Battlesphere athletes stick to grappling and swords, so seeing you grow through your unique fighting styles was pretty inspirational and aspirational. Shame about the museum. I used to visit a lot when I was a pup. My favorite part was the weapons exhibit hall. From swords to early energy rifle prototypes, the museum had some great displays. I still get all tingly thinking about them. I haven't seen Dale use his capture card since his father was still alive. I think they remind him of too much of what happened. Capture cards. They've been the signature weapons for the, of the royal family for generations. I'm not really sure how they work, but they're pretty cool anyhow. Wish I could jump as high as the leaner guys. Oh well. I make up for it with raw stopping power. Foes won't even get a chance to jump when my pole arm goes through them. Cyclone! Someone's been stealing all of our swords, so I'm holding on to this one. The Avian Museum got robbed. Stones! First they came for our swords, another after ancient artifacts. Vavilus? The nerve of those guys. Sure, there was like something hidden here. Oh god, is that the King meme face? Unbelievable. This game is a it's a game. It, you wouldn't have to have any unusually colored shards, would you? For trading, I mean. likes to bury drinks in the ground behind the lumber shed. He says it keeps them cold. We're almost there. How did I get here before you? It's a secret. Or oh, Judy, whoops. Just a few more steps. Say? There's a secret tunnel under the floor that whisks us to the other side. Try and find it. Good evening, King Dale. The sun hasn't even set yet. Seems like these infernal devices are useful after all. The traitor. So, he sent you, did he? Very well. We need you to track down a thief. A large portion of our weapons and steel reserves have mysteriously vanished. And no, I am not imagining things. Steel, huh? Not profitable enough for the Red Scarves. My brother wouldn't steal from me. I'd bust him up good. Oh, right, the anyway, other guy. We believe Hard the dude. supplies were taken north, but I don't want to send my soldiers out there until we know who or what we're dealing with. You can count on me, Your Majesty. I'll get to the bottom of this. When I heard about the attack on the Avian Museum, I was almost certain that Spade was involved. Hitting a target that big for its valuables is my brother's style, after all. With its ports destroyed, shang -Tu's ability to defend itself against invasion has fallen sharply. Have a care that this does not become the city's downfall. Happy to catch a broadcast of your performance in the Battlesphere. Most entertaining. Ah, to engage in such revelry, but as a simple commoner combatant. I seem to recall my brother participating at one point. 
His illustrious career as a con artist and a thief has its excitements. Also, stay also. Spade makes for a poignant stage name. Hey, where's that hidden path you're, that they're talking about? Give General Gong my regards. Tell him there will be freshly steamed bows waiting for him should he decide to pay us a visit. Is there, like, a solid wall back here? Oh, there we go. I found it. It's simply right near the two, uh, the two ramps. Uh-oh. Game kind of glitched out on me there. I didn't know you were tagging along. Magister sent me. Well, my nose anyway. Thought you could use a bloodhound on your team. Detective Mila is on the case too. Or two. The first rule of detectiving is to never let your mark know you're there. Ain't that right, partner? I'm not your partner, Pop. Mila, are you sure you want to come along? If you want to sit this one out... It's fine. We can split up to cover more ground. So, what's the sit rep? We're heading north. Citrus. We'll probably find what we're looking for there. Fine. Let's get this over with. What's the what now? The what and the who? Robot Graveyard. That sounds fun. Nothing bad, but nothing bad over here. Oh, is this the robot? Gra okay, I think I know why it's called this. Or I think I know why it's this. Because in the, at the end of the first game, you had like a big fight against the aliens in this area. And you, you, you have to fight a ton of our enemies here, so... I guess the implication is it's, it's the remains of those enemies. This game does really good with the callbacks. about to get worse. Whatever. Mm -hmm. I'll just give him a one-way ticket home, courtesy of the hundred hook punch. Oh, they're supposed to be like math tutors and divide their numbers. I'll see you on the other side. They're supposed to be the, the aliens from the first game.
That's kind of funny when like a video game gets announced with like a returning villain. The fans of the game will be like, oh cool, we're gonna see this guy again. And you almost never think, oh, the people who the, the people who actually experience the game, the characters, are probably traumatized as fuck seeing this character again. Interesting disconnect between you and the uh, and the characters. I think Kirby ever gets pissed at how many times he has to fight Wispy Woods. Sparkly. Like, god damn it, stupid tree! How many times do I have to teach you this lesson? Also, blowing up those makes the uh, eyeballs come out of it, like in the first game. Cyclone. Which doesn't happen with most of the enemies here. They have that like weird like face that comes out instead. I saw that down there for like a split second and I didn't think of following up. Welcome. Please state your identity. Uh, Sash Lilac. I'm sorry. I did not understand. Sash Lilac. Did you mean Squidhead? What? Oh, someone is definitely going to pay for that. And I get the feeling I know who. Enemies detected. Executing slaughter sequence with the two. Squares. Uh-oh. Laser beam. Oh, you still lose a life when you when you die. Okay. Like all right. So it's not unlimited retries. It just means you start with full health and have to start the boss over again. To be honest, I'm, I'm enjoying this game, but this, these boss themes have not hit like the boss theme in the first game did. That was still my favorite of, of all of them so far, but... I'm gonna think that the final boss theme in the first game was amazing as well. I saw that exclamation point there at the last second. I was like, uh oh. That would have killed me, too. 
Okay, so your remaining lives are taken into, uh, consideration. By default, you only get three. Move it! Whew! Thanks, Eskel. Just in time. Where's Mila? The pup's keeping watch outside. I'm here to help you search the place. Or punch things, probably. <laughs> Have you found the thief? Worse. We found a hideout that's swarming with Brevin's robots. That is unsettling news. Did you encounter the villain himself? We haven't found anyone yet, but someone has to be controlling them. Find out who it is. I will assemble a strike force if necessary. <laughs> Shade Armory. That thing from uh, Sonic Advance One. Okay, let's just stop moving. Yep. Okay, right away I know I could tell what the stage is, is deriving a lot of influence from. I can swim up that. Oh. Uh, oh, there's probably a gate down there that's unlocked now. Go! Yep. I'm still going. I'm probably gonna be going till close to like six ish. Well, I don't know. Either that or whenever I beat the story. I don't know how long these this, this game is, but Cyclone! Here's the question: Am I gonna do one story of this, or am I gonna do the whole game? Six body signal, so rip. It's okay. Cyclone. I don't want to touch that. <laughs> I'll still stream tonight, mate. I actually I don't know. I might not stream tonight. It depends. I, I don't think I'm gonna be finishing this in one sitting, so. Maybe I will come back tonight. Okay, thank you.
game. Cool, 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 give me that. This is a maze. I have to like push them in the right order. That hurts a lot. Hurts a little bit, hurts a lot.
Nice. Did it without having to uh, continue. Okay, just land on the card. Land on the card. Oh my god. Stay classy. <laughs> Snowfields. Wait, what? Oh, I can't go back. Probably just a boss fight, I think, because it's red. Come on! I don't have all day! No! Shut up! Mila? Fine! Then by the will of Lord Brevin, I sentence you to death! Mother! Uh, oh, this dude! That robot! I, General Serpentine Commander! How are you still alive? Mila! What are you doing here, Snake? Is Brevin back? Is he? <laughs> How are you Tremble in fear. Once Lord Brevin returns, it will all be nothing but a pitiful spear on the shattered remnants of this wretched planet! Once Lord Brevin returns, so he's not back. <sighs> Fortunately for you, you've caught me in a charitable mood. So here's the deal. You give me the robot, and I won't blast you and your friends into the stratosphere. Well, here's my deal. You leave us alone, and you never come back. Nobody hurts my friends. Yeah! Fine! Then die! Ha! Go down like the rest of them. Ha! Ha! <laughs> Ow. Or I could jump right into his main attack like that. I was gonna shoot up. Invincible why he does that too. Hold still so I can destroy you already. Lay down and die. Yeah, whatever. More? Oh my god. Boss fight looks fun, yeah. Checkpoint at least. Nope. I have to do the whole thing over again. I 
may have to use items here. I just noticed that when I start from the checkpoint, I have all, all my lives back, so I shouldn't bother restarting from the checkpoint unless I know I absolutely need to, uh... Unless I know I absolutely need to... Uh, restart it. It'd be nice if there was a way for me to just quick shop from here. Oh, I can't return anyway right now, so it doesn't matter. Alright. Let's go to my item loadout here. Max life up. Always have an empty health meter. Items to bombs. No. No guarding. No revivals. Life oscillation. That one's interesting, but I'm not going to be able to keep up with, with that. I'm switching between no health and all health every 30 seconds. Okay, you can only equip one of that as well. I don't know how the potion works, though. Get in the next stage with 25% towards your next stock. 40 units gives you an extra stock. Here's the number of crystals you need for a stock by 15. Your physical attacks absorb 10% more life. So I guess if I do all five of these, I get 50% of the damage I deal back. There's really nothing, no way to use it. I'm right on top of it. There's like no damage to me. Oh, that attack sucks. I'm still doing terribly. God, it's still ridiculously hard. Starting because it's gonna make me lose uh, 
things. Oh, fucking hell. That was- that was bull- that was bullshit. Oh my god. This game's fun enough that I don't care that much, but that was- that was a load of shit. Oh, I can guard- Wow, I keep forgetting to just fucking guard it. There we go. Michael remembers the L button exists. Hit him. It just seems random whether or not he takes damage. <sighs> that did kind of suck. I beat him. I absolutely beat him. I can enter with full health instead of constantly missing like two of them. Alright. 
Oh, so you only lose a set amount of the bonus per item that you use. So I only lost 15% of the extra bonus. I'm guessing it's 50-50, so if, like, you get through the stage with no items used and no lives lost, you get double the, double the items. But since I use two items, rare wear logo... <laughs> So this Serpentine was behind the incident. A relief, to say the least. I'm just glad to hear that Brevin's not back. <sighs> father. Wait, that robot thing is his dad? No. His father, the previous king, was murdered by the intergalactic warlord Brevin. Yeah, but he helped he him. He chased Brevin off our world, but not before he left his mark on us. Oh, yeah. Heard the stories. Sounded made up. Didn't even think they could be true. <laughs> I wasn't strong enough. No, you weren't. Nira! There was nothing you could have done differently. But look at you now. You are the king of Shui Gong. Your people look to you for guidance and leadership. You've only grown stronger since that day, your majesty. And you do your father's memory proud. My people and I will take over from here. If the monster has truly returned, you will be the first to know. Thank you, your majesty. No. Thank you. Okay, and happy music. When I heard that Serpentine was back, my first thought was that I'd like to find that slimy little ash bowl, stuff him in a throttle, and turn him into snake wine? What? Where'd that come from, brain? I need more sleep. It's hard, though. What with Gordo snoring and Judy's wet dog smell? I can ask for a room reassignment. Since the rout of your General Serpentine and his forces, we have seen neither scale nor tail of that snake. It appears he has moved on, which is worrisome in of itself. When I heard about the attack on the Ave- Oh, it's almost- Yeah. Still has thing above his head. Okay, are you not gonna say anything new? Fear General and Brevin's army to literal trash man living in the garbage. We discuss the infamy and subsequent fall of Serpentine tonight on Tri Kingdom News. I'm Miria Note. You tell me if Brevin was back, right? Come on, you could trust me. Journalist Integrity is my middle name. If it was, you would have said it correctly. Thanks for cleaning up who's been stealing our stuff. That's a load off my mind. Why would they rob a museum, too? What does an alien snake general want with a bunch of old bones? That's the part I don't get. The background didn't load right there. You smell like a durian that gone, that's gone off. Have you been rolling around in literal garbage? Please wash your shoes. Those big stompers of yours are at nose level, and the stench is potent. Can't believe those aliens came back, and they're living in our garbage. Well, that's a depressing turn. I remember that alien attack like it was yesterday. It's not every day you see a giant blue dragon battle a fleet of spaceships in a dogfight. No pun intended. you again for helping King Dale with this problem. Both both his problems. Seems like Gong has taught you well. Perhaps I have room in my book to mention his young trainee. Cyclone! Chloe is no mere ferret selling her wares. Chloe is a brand. When you think Chloe, think rare exotic goods available at moderately fair prices. Oh, she's got more. Be in the stage of an energizer sphere. Your attack power increases when you have no stocks left. Press guard to create a shadow clone of your character that copies your attacks. Uh, 
this is Maria Note reporting live. We interrupt this program to bring you a special news flash. Mayor Zhao has been kidnapped. He is currently being held hostage somewhere in the Globe Opera. Eyewitnesses say he was taken by mechanical creatures that emerged from Shang Mu's River Delta. What the? Guys, come quick! We've just received word that the military has been deployed to maintain order. Citizens are urged to remain calm and to stay in their homes. We're getting a call. On screen. Hello, friends. Uh, funny story. Well, not so much funny as completely horrifying. But you see. Okay, okay, okay. So long story short, they're gonna kill me if you don't give them what they want. So please, 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 just do what they say. Get me out of here. Magister, how I've longed to see that look in your eyes. It's her. Is that a water dragon? That's impossible. What trickery is this? No trickery at all, Magister. Such deception would be the purview of your grandfather, not I. You speak nonsense. Truly? Then why not tell your students what's really going on? Poor Hatchling. I'd laugh if it weren't such sad irony. I don't know who you are, but I'm going to make sure you don't hurt anyone else. This land is protected! Hatchling. Have you ever wondered what happened to all of the water dragons? <sighs> Enough! What do you want? What I want is for you to answer for all that you've done. But for the time being, I have more pressing concerns. This is Bakunawa. Magnificent, is she not? I like, that's a nice but 3D she is model. Missing a vital component. The drone you call Hengu. The one that's in the room with you right now. I'd like to have it. Bring it to the Globe Opera. You'd better hurry, though. Red pandas are very much my favorite snack. See you soon. And if we let him get eaten. Who was that? Magister? Our worst fears realized. A merciless centurion from a time when our land was ravaged by war. Whoa. A creature bred for battle, with a lust for bloodshed. Such a lust. Murga. Revenge. Murga. So what's she need the robot for? Some kind of data in its memory banks, perhaps? Something crucial to the operation of this... Bakunawa. That pilot, Corazon. She demanded that robot as well. Kari isn't with her! There's no way she'd do that! If you say so. An unfortunate coincidence, then. Let me go after her! Please, Your Excellency! I acknowledge your strength, brave Dragonblood. But her power is unlike anything you or your companions have ever faced before. Could've used her help when we fought Brevin, then. Still, perhaps there is a slight hope that she can be reasoned with. Somehow, I don't think she wants to talk. Yeah, and the thought of just giving her the drone gives my stomach the rumblies. What about the one we took from Snake Man? It looks just like Pangu. Maybe it could fool her? Yeah, a fresh lick of blue paint and nobody will tell the difference. A fair enough distraction. We must buy as much time as we can to free the mayor. But first, we need to find a way inside that won't draw attention. Wah. On screen! Come in, my Shang Tsujin friends. This is Captain Kalau. Perfect timing, Captain. We have an emergency. I am aware of the mayor's kidnapping, friends. I believe that together, we can quickly resolve this most dire of situations. You have our gratitude, Captain. Do you have the mayor's location? Indubitably. This isn't mayor a trap Zhao at all. was last seen in the central theater area. We'll meet you there. Stay oh. vigilant, friends. Anything could happen. He's Anthrogumi. Globe <laughs> Opera. Oh, it's a new area. I was like, why? Bird makes you laugh. Yes, yeah, it's, it's a good bird. Good birdie. Uh, 
Uh, no, I don't want to buy any vinyl. Uh, we already done, done, gone, done that. Attacks cause lingering damage to enemies. I'll get these. Close this shop out. Kinda all I can do. Globe Opera. Oh, this is multiple stages. Now yeah, there's there's like police boats around it. You know the battle sphere in Shangmu to unlock boss rematches. Oh, so it has nothing to do with the museum. There's like no point to this, it just lists their species and home. Still cool though. So where did the they animate her flying here, even though she's not flying in the uh, area she's in? They have all the sailors. Anything new here? About the 40 citizens. Store and exhibit. Nah, I haven't gotten a new, uh. Oh, perfect run, clear stage without losing any life pedals. Nice. I got that automatically from the race. <laughs> That's cool. This drone is dripping wet! This blue is not a judicious color. Sorry about that, Captain. You know what to do, right? Uh, we'll go back to no items. Don't want to use them unless I need them. I will say, having the state, the, sta the zones be a single stage now, just be long and just be longer, allows the game to have a lot more variety. Because now we're not doing two stages of the same theme. <laughs> Even though some of these themes are similar, so I guess it really doesn't matter. Cyclone! Okay. Oh, it makes platforms. That's interesting. I don't think I'm moving forward here. No.
Oh, wait, wait, wait. Health down there, I need it. Here we go. Okay, there's an enemy. Bitch, who gets left behind? The stage music in this game is really good. It's just kind of the boss themes are a little, a little less uh, impactful than the first games. Dragon Powerhouse. Cyclone. Ooh, that's a lot of cores. Gotta go. Satisfying noise when they shoot when they make that attack. Sounds like you're hitting, like, a volleyball. It's not satisfying to get hit by that a million times. There we go. <laughs> it goes on and off. Wait, what? Why did I do that? I knew that was gonna hurt me, and I went for it anyway.
awesome art. You gotta be kidding me. Oh, whoa. Again, I have to have this be the active window or I can't play it. It's not like the DS where I could just have it be in the background. Globe Opera 2. I'm approaching the rendezvous point. Show yourself, you pugilistic physignathus. I, Captain Kalau, bring an offering of peace. Level. Yeah. Uh huh. Psych. Psych. The real me was right here the whole time. This is this is unsettling. going. Cyclone! Yep, each one's activating another type of enemy. Oh 
god, punch his enemies. out the game there a bit. <laughs> Cyclops! Well, you can't go through those. Those bounce you. Attack is the Griffin attack from uh from uh Shovel Knight. Wrong button for this. I need to do all six of these, or I need to do four of them, okay. end of game vibes, but I feel like it's too early for the end of the game. We didn't even do any missions that were four or five star. Like, the three we had were one, two, and three. 
And I think they went up to five. You can just slide up this. Maybe you do only need to do four of them. all the way. I don't need to do the other two. But I wonder what happens if I do. wonky hitboxes on these, but... Mistake. Cyclone! 
Joker moment. Why do I keep missing that block? This is absolutely not a speedrun area. Do not come to this area if you're looking for speedruns. It's the worst mistake of my life. Completionist. Oh, nice. Got an achievement for doing it. Well worth it. Could have really used uh, a shield, but okay. this boss from the first game. mystical they're just blazing hot fire nice that wasn't too bad
Kilo Gem. Oh, nice! I got over a thousand in one stage. Yeah! There was another- there was a CD in there, though. Somewhere. Auditorium. Come in, Cap! Is everything alright over there? Are you there? Captain? What, what happened? We have to hurry. If the captain is in trouble, we need to save Zhao right now! Mayor Zhao? Where are you? Say something if you can hear us! He's already dead. No. He's already someone. fit, because he played the, the Fist of the it's North Star captain fitness Kalao. game. Captain! He's alright! Hey, Cap! Glad you could make it! Captain! Did you meet up with Murga? Did she fall for the decoy? Uh... Captain? There's someone behind him! <laughs> Corey! What are you and Shortstop doing here? They're with the monster. What? That's crazy, scary lady. Wrong! We're all buddies and best pals over here! Womp womp. What? What the heck's going on? You're all working for Murga? Are you all brainwashed or something? No, Carol. Believe it or not, I'm doing this for you. Some injustices can never be forgiven. Where is Murga? Huh? Everyone stand your ground. Right. Why can't I sense her? <gasps> so, Hatchling, you've come after all. Where is Zhao? Captain, if you'd please. He's okay. Let's get out of here. I think not. Now that all the players have gathered, it is time for this performance to end. But... but you have Pangu, right? We did what you asked! We had a deal, Murga! The deal did not include distracting me so you could free this miserable speck of a man. Besides, even without my informant, I could clearly recognize the machine you brought as a fake. Whoa! Had a sound effects to play and it didn't load properly. Damn it. Hologram. She was never here in the first place. Take care of our guests. A delight, ladies. General, Poof. come in. Gong, do you copy? Nah, uh, spoilers. Nothing's getting in or out thanks to my signal jammer playmate, casual acquaintance number forty-seven. All fighters, fangs out. You're not actually going to fight your own sister, are you? Of course not. I would never hurt my beloved sibling. You, fight my beloved sibling. <laughs> of course. How of is course. this any different? Captain, don't do this. Not only because I still think you're cool and stuff, but didn't I already beat you once the first time? That was the old Captain Kalau. A Captain Kalau that was holding back. Now. He has awakened his true strength. I love him. With the flames of burning justice. Why does Ah sound like Uni from Neptunia? I've actually, Come I actually on, don't gang. know. Split also, him hey, up how and you doing? Take him down. Who am I fighting? Lion. I wonder if everyone fights a different boss here. Eh. Ooh, oh, 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 that's scary. Sure, I like that. What's scarier than a lion? Lion with a gun. Oh, I'm getting wrecked. This thing does a lot of damage. Out the items here again. Again, the items in the boss fights aren't really worth all that much because you don't get many. Uh, you don't get many uh, gems from this to begin with. 
So there's really no harm in uh kidding yourself out in the best uh items you can bring in. Hey yeah, from how you doing? No, because I have to pay gems for that to happen. And like when there, when it's just a boss fight, there's really no point in doing that. Come in, Cap. Turns all the crystal flowers in the stage into life flowers. Burst. Uh, attacks, your attacks cause lingering water damage to enemies. Okay. Yeah, this is pretty much as good as I can get it. Without going back and, and buying more. Way bigger than it was before. Most invigorating warm up, brave fighters, but the battle is just beginning. Behold! My greatest playmate yet! The BFF 2000! Fighters, form up! Three! Two! One! Oh, Activate! Oh, so the first one would have been different depending on who you play as, I guess. Checking in. Combat mode execute. Cool. Oh, it's a checkpoint. Nice. Cyclone. Oh no! Why did that? Be oh come on! Why did beam have to do damage? fight from the beginning. Crotch of iron. Can I for this to hit Nintendo Switch next year? Yes, yeah, same. I, I really wanted it to be multi-platform from the beginning, but I'm willing to deal with this on Steam. For now. <laughs>
Oh, right where I'm where I was gonna be. Oh, come on, really? The explosions do lingering damage? Turn to checkpoint 500. Oh, man, is that really worth losing that many gems? Oh, you can just punch this to get extra gems. It gets farther and farther away the more you punch it, though. <sighs> Let me exit to map, see if there's something I could buy to maybe make this a little easier to manage. And there. Get a few more of those uh, cores that I need. I've already bought this one out. Yeah, bought both of those already. No shop there. There's a shop here. Or do I- wait. Chloe thinks people make fun of Chloe for talking in the third person. It makes her sad until Chloe remembers she swims in a big pile of gold gems every night, and they don't. Chloe wins. Yeah, she still's got she still got stuff. Begin the stage with an energizer sphere. Press guard to create a shadow clone of your character. Potion increases the damage of your physical attacks. I might have to do that. Jumping power, increase your maximum speed, increase the number of hits that elemental shields can absorb, increase the damage of your attacks. Well, it's the same thing. This is cheaper. Cover life petals when reviving. Oh, it's a potion. Physical set of attacks absorb 10% more. Wait, increases the damage of your physical attacks by 4%. Oh, that's not what I wanted. So 
the most I can increase it 20%. But then I don't heal. As much. Start that. I think that was uh, kind of bullshitty. Way better. A most in <laughs> I rocked right into it like a fucking moron. Why do I keep doing that? Cyclone. Why does it game make me think you have to beat all four stories to unlock a final story? Do you? I don't know. Why did I do it twice like an idiot? Alright. Good aim that I have here. I'm doing so well. Cyclone. It's the 
boss thing on the screen before the title screen? I don't know. I don't pay attention. I don't remember, that was hours ago. Why? I was nowhere near it. Gems are supposed to get there. Look, a way out. Come on, Kari. She'll be fine. We need to leave. Yeah, now. the blue line show you where you where you're not supposed to be. No, no, don't mind me. I have this perfectly under control. Wriggling to freedom is my forte. <laughs> Do you copy? Magister! Askel! Anyone! Useless! This was a trap from the beginning. We need to get back to the Magister! Run, dragon! As fast as you can! What about us? Don't worry. I have a cunning plan. Also, you have a motorbike. Ah, uh, this is so uncool. <laughs> Hold on, guys. I'm almost there. Please be okay. Palace Courtyard, it's another boss fight, so should probably just bring the stuff. tilted there. <laughs> Oops. Run, 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 run. Okay. One of three? Oh no. Let's 
using the skills of both of them at once. It's very clever. Very good call and response there. That's not the right turn. I don't like how the game's getting stingy with the heals. No one's inside. I hope everyone evacuated safely. It's empty inside. Even the drink barrels are gone. At least the dragon statue's okay. Thanks, kid. They got the drop on us. Took Gong and the Magister. Left me for dead. We gotta find them! Come on! Cyclone! We just leave that there. We don't need to worry about it. Lilac! No! <laughs> Traitor! Ascal! Stop! What are you doing? The right thing. Magister, you stand accused of covering up the war crimes of your ancestors. How do you plead? What? Is, is that what Murga told you? Why would you believe her? Shut up, kid. This doesn't concern you. Think it's about time you had a taste of your own medicine. No! Stop it! <laughs> Well, isn't that a surprise? I always figured you were older than me. Well, whatever. From now on, the world is gonna see you for what you really are. A war criminal. First time I have face. always served to keep the peace of the people and the city of Shang Tu. If that is a war crime, then so be it. Yeah? You think you can do any better? <laughs> me? No. Sitting on a throne all day telling people what to do doesn't do it for me. But I'll tell you what. I know someone who's really looking forward to it. No. Goo monsters. You seem unhinged, Magister. Ah, yes. I can sense your anger. Your seething hatred. But it is nothing. Amplified a thousandfold and still it would quiver against the raging typhoon within me. The Kingdom Stone is no more! The floodgates have opened. You shall welcome death! <laughs> no! I won't let you kill him! Open your eyes, Hatchling! This man has lied to you! All of you! His entire life! Do you remember the question? The question I asked, but he dared not answer. Hmm. What happened to all of the water dragons? Shut up! I'm not listening to you! They were murdered. All of them. Entire clans of water dragons wiped out. Also, his kind could lay claim to the world that we once called home. It's... I... No, I don't... Move aside, Hatchling! He will answer for his people's crimes, and then we can talk. No! I won't! Not like this! There has to be a better way than this! Like what? Diplomacy? Yeah. The art of offering one hand in friendship, while the other holds a dagger behind their back. No, we just no. have to try him. Never again. Earth dragons are schemers and liars! Lilac, what's going on? Oh boy, a lot, I'm guessing. Your Excellency. What have they done to you? And so the cavalry arrives, just in time to witness your Magister's 
fatal indictment. Pascal, of all people, it was you? Sorry you had to find out this way, Nira. I'll explain everything later, but right now, the Magister has to go. I've already gone through the trouble of sparing one panda today. I don't intend to do so a second time. The lives and ideals of this kingdom are but an extension of my own. I will not yield! <laughs> you think to stop me? Come then, show me your resolve. Health left. I do like this this fight though. All of us at once. Oh, she can knock everyone out. in the same spot. She could dash like that. Yeah, it's probably a water dragon technique. Ah! She can do the same move. do this right now. I don't really have an enemy to go to this stage again right at the moment. She's got some kind of new power, yeah. That's that's how it works when the bosses hit a certain health, they usually switch their pattern. Guard button. I I can't time. Never time it right. Better. Oh. Stage cleared. Okay. Guess I wasn't expected to win that. <laughs> she gets angry, so angry she's at half health. There's too many of them! 
We will bring peace and stability to this city at any cost! We will not bow down to traitors! Nira, stop! And that's it! We're out of here! Bubble. Let them go. We have what we came for. I guess the game is what not over What about the Magister? Yet. He needs to answer for everything he's done. If he wants to prolong his suffering, then so be it. His time will come soon enough. I wonder if beating her there gets you anything. If his allies return, I will kill them. <laughs> Evil whale. It's weird that they even let you continue if that was a scripted loss. Enough, Nira! We've lost! Cowards! How could you all just run away? Nira, it wasn't a battle we could win. Right now, we have to get everyone to safety. Then we can figure out what to do. It's my home. It'll be okay, Lady Nira. Forgive me. We should get moving. I should have known better than trusting you. Sorry. Him. Just too well timed. You have all done this world a great service. As long as my plans advance appropriately, your city will not be harmed. Bakunawa will rise. Okay. Oh, it's Spade. Where's he been this whole game? That scale must have been talking to them behind my back. Even as I was training him, I should have been paying more attention. I failed my kingdom. Is a fish at fault when it takes a fisherman's bait? Perhaps. But the fisherman's role should not be ignored. Uh, okay. I... I think I get that, Magister. Of course, now I'm hungry. Me too. I'm starving! Wait a minute. Uh, I hope I still have them. The coupons! Free dinner! And shelter. Let's head to Shangmu. Your Excellency. It is a sound idea. Let's go to an entire kingdom away. And, and rest our weary souls there. City Hall. Oh, that's the mayor's mayor's place. Oh, I can't even go over there anymore. It's blocked off for the time being. I have ancient water dragons with a grudge. I know Shang 2 was going to be like this. I would have built my museum somewhere else. bosses we have left. I don't know what that is. That's a galaxy trail symbol. So we have one boss that is not filled in. One, two, three. Cyclone! Two. So we have at least two more big bosses, but also I think the humanoid bosses, like the, the character bosses, don't show up there. So so uh, Nurga would not, uh, or Murga would not show up here. To raise funds, I had to sell my shares of a news media company to Jebediah, my best friend at the time. They gave, this gave him a controlling interest in the company and gave me the money to finish my factory. However, when I finally released my first wave of Winston's confections, what awaited me was a scathing review from Tri-Kingdom News, written by my so-called friend himself, who had spoken since.
Boom. certainly give you a lot of stuff to spend your 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 IGC on I need I need a, a thing for that one, a special one. So that BFF 2000 is kind of huge, huh? Stones. How did it all fit in the Globe Opera? I think I'm going to need more orange pencil if I want to finish drawing that robot. For sure, that was almost the end of the game, but I guess not. I didn't want to see something because there's a thing about uh, the cards here. Shang Bu still stands, but Shang Tu has fallen. An unexpected and troubling turn of events. I wonder where Florence was in the middle of the incident, however. He was supposed to be on duty. I heard you fought a giant robot piloted by a serpentine general from outer space. I am overcome with a violent envy. Tell me everything. Spare no detail. My bucket list is highly specific, and I am living vicariously through your experience. Battlefield debut was adequate, yet I find myself dissatisfied with the lack of serious injury and breaking of bones. I suggest trying harder next time. Race the feel of the battle, the clashing of bone and sinew. That was unexpected. We didn't think she'd show her hand so early. Not in order that I turn out to be a royal flush. Looks like we're all in the back paw now. We got our eyes on the inside though, and we'll get in contact if things start getting worse. That serpentine is one slippery snake, but don't worry, we have our eye on him. Our way of ensuring the safety of Avalis doesn't always involve dealing with the stuffed shirts in charge. Ha! <laughs> when those cowardly terrorists ran off, I'd have showed them a thing or two. Well, where was I when those cowardly terrorists took the Globe Opera and held our beloved Mayor Zhao hostage? Uh, it was my night off. You think your new Battlesphere champion title impresses me? Think again. You only know the sport of violence, not the real deal. Not like me. Out there in the mean streets of Shangmu, you see things. Things that your pampered self wouldn't believe. Luckily for you, I am there, standing between our citizens and the encroaching darkness. I was actually here the entire time. My cape bestows upon me the power to turn invisible and be as silent as the wind on a windless night. The cape was a gift to my aunt, who was actually the Grand Duchess of the Shape Shapers, Shade Shapers, a clan of assassins so secret no one knows they actually exist. Yeah, you could say that again, Blank. This isn't funny, Bal. I know it isn't Blake, I'm just... I'm sorry. That was flippin' to me. I wasn't considerate of your feelings. We worry about what's happening in Shang-Tu together. Yeah, okay, alright. Sorry for blowing up on you. It's okay, Blake. There are bad times, and I'm glad we're just together to face it. <laughs> yeah. Can't imagine a better person to have my back, pal. This is Maria Note with a comprehensive report on the still-unfolding incident that has now been dubbed Revenge of the Water Dragons. From the kidnapping of Shang Bu's beloved Mayor Zhao to the capture of Shang Tu by Water Dragon guerrilla forces. Oh. <gasps> Take a breath there. Tri Kingdom News is the only news network to have minute by minute live coverage of the incident as it transpired. Hey, what happened to Globe Opera? Inquiring viewers, inquiring viewers want to know. Your recent victory over Captain Kalosh's challenge has captured the attention of our entire city. What's your secret? It's no secret. You're just that good. Way to go. We 
between us girls. The rent for vinyl venue is pretty high, so seeing my landlord get kidnapped and held hostage on live TV was super cathartic. Not saying I wanted something permanent to happen to Mayor Zhao, but maybe it wouldn't be so bad if he'd roughed up and roughed up a little more? Congrats on your battles for your debut. Now comes the most important part of your career. Choosing a theme song. What separates the amps from the pros? What a brave stone from Blake. Didn't make me any braver, but it did make me wiser. Someone beat my high score in dance now. Who are you, L1NC? Show yourself. Yeah, for a haircut? Sorry, I can't do walk-ins right now. In the meantime, I have a Perusian Sawakian. Sawakian. I keep saying that wrong. Salawakian. A man who talks too much accomplishes little. Speaks, ha, for itself. Oh, my stones. Whatever will we do now? Is shang -Lu safe? Will I have to abandon my salon? It seems silly to have to worry about such things, but they're all I have. Another Perusian Sawak... Salawak... Wow. Salawakian comes to mind. The wise woman doesn't look at her foot in the ground. She sees her next step. So a warning system that relies on crackly loudspeakers and flashing lights to show where the nearest shelters are? Turns out, not great for bats. Nothing like loud disorienting sounds and strobe-colored lightning lights to make flying an absolute nightmare. I think I'm getting a headache just thinking about it. Maybe wondering, how does a bat eat noodle soup upside down? The answer is, very carefully. And also, accept the inevitability of what I like to call soup face. I mean, I could also just sit down at a table like everybody else, but where's the fun in that? Here, my dear, is that you? You look different today. Oh, I'm sorry, young lady. I need a new pair of glasses soon. I appreciate the time. Okay. Wait, are you the lady that got the fight to fight Captain Claw? Hot stones. I'm only two degrees of separation away from Captain Claw. I'm telling all my friends. Catching up on one of my favorite shows, Rose. Wow, so much crazy stuff went down. Girls got their butts kicked. It looks like the bad guys won. Stones. Girls are at their lowest. Relationships are at their breaking point. This is the end of Team Rose. Find out next season. They finally ported the Inspector Periodical games. Now I can play the adventures of Grimface and Inspector Periodical and his plucky sidekick Sammy on the go. Their latest case has them investigating a mysterious tower filled with evidence and clues from their previous cases. Coincidence or the work of an old foe? Spooky. Ah oh yeah, Phoenix Cab Super. It's the latest fighting game series and has all the characters. I mean it's Kiwiko, cause she kicks butt. It's also a spin-off called Phoenix Cube Legends, where he plays a Starfruit Topi and have to say all time and space from a mysterious threat. For some reason all the characters are named after and based on fruits. Don't know why. Cute though. Arkley cast because my preference is kangaroo. score but I got him I got the achievement pond hopper <laughs> 
freaked out there because it went across the entire stage. Nice, got the high score. Die happy now. Holy stones! I didn't know they were uh, they were taking the story of the battle sphere and turning an in uh, holy stones. I didn't know they were taking the battle the story out of the battle sphere and into the real world. It's so meta. Gotta say though, making the ultimate heal to be some kind of ancient resurrected water dragon terrorist. Wicked. That's some crazy creative television right there. I stick to Apple Street, man. I hope you talk about the bat. Heard you beat the champ. Nice. One day it's gonna be my name all up in lights. Toby Stripes, the tiger from the east. And actually, I'm actually a local, but nobody needs to know that. Ooh, what a night. Still managed to get some work done, though. A couple of adjustments to the cooling vents, so we improved the battle bot's heat dispersal by 3%. High six. I do not have enough to exchange. Hope you had fun out there. The bots will always be waiting for you, like always. Cyclone! Hey, what happened in the Globe Opera? Our beloved Mayor Zhao was kidnapped, and Captain Kalaw was involved somehow? Of course, I also heard that Captain Kalaw transformed into a giant super fighting robot, so maybe I shouldn't believe everything I hear. Oof. The BFC is really taking a shine to you and your girl power. Some of our Perusian fans are really excited about you being a water dragon. One of them keeps asking for a lock of your hair. We're launching a line of leather jackets called Caro's Attitude Line. No matter how many times I tell Igor, he keeps calling Elim a rabbit. Nira wants a list of our members. She's not going to interrogate the entire fan base, is she? Some of them might actually like that, though. Holy stones, that was an absolute fright of a time. Pardon my language. I'm glad no one got seriously hurt, though. Could have turned out a lot worse than a slightly bruised, tied-up Mayor Zhao. Oh, yeah, you have to be invited to go in there. That's where all the famous... Yeah, we already know that. There's no way to actually get in there. Arena battle, boss battle. Fight your way through obstacle courses and waves of enemy robots. Home run. Hit as many targets as you can before touching the ground. Oh, it counts the three. It counts the four that you cleared. Most collapsing you rush forward to the goal. Oh, wow. There's a lot of stuff to do here. You can refight the bosses. Acrobell, that's a new boss, though. As many targets as you can before touching the ground. Change your items here. Okay. Interesting. So there's a lot of a lot of stuff you could do here. But we won't be doing them just yet. for nothing. Welcome! Uh, hi, Mayor Zhao. We're ready to redeem our coupons. Oh, oh, but of course! Just step right this way! Uh, uh, huh, um, who's that? That's the Magister, you rube. Pay your respects. Oh, <laughs> boy, is this, uh, awkward. It's a long story. Can we explain it all inside? Please? <sighs> oh, I know I'm gonna regret this. Come on. I'm gonna actually have to stop this soon because it's almost dinner time. absolutely horrible! Catastrophic! Who's going to be my Battlesphere champion now?! A talking fish just took over all of Shang-2 and that's what you're worried about?! 
Yeah. Oh, but also dibs on the Battle Sphere champion title. So can we stay here? I suppose I could squeeze you all in the library. Follow me. I love that portrait of him in the back where he's really tall. About what Murga was telling us. Was any of that true? Yes. Why? It was a different time. We were at war. We had no choice. No choice? How was almost wiping out an entire race even a choice? There are no good choices in war. There is only survival. And the means to achieve said survival. Surely someone of your upbringing would understand that. Oh no. Don't you dare try and guilt trip me. I never killed anyone when I was in the Red Scarves. And yet. Did you not behave in a manner contrary to your true self, simply because to do otherwise would invite the scorn of your peers? Did you not comfort yourself with a hopeless lie that you were a good person, hmm. in spite of the crimes you committed? The sins you inflicted? You don't know what you're talking about! You don't know anything! Hey, that's enough! That's still the Magister you're shouting at! Besides, this here is a library. Oh, nuts. I was expecting more cutscene time there. What is this? Hold on. You're hoping to connect with professionals to paid for can Wait, what? Selection process of broadband internet access provided. I got like a spam email trying to recruit me into explaining internet to people. Buddy, I don't understand the internet. <laughs> these, book looks, these books look random and unorganized, but there's a couple of interesting ones. Unlike the mainland kingdoms, Perusa has no ruler. A tribunal consisting of the five strongest warriors on the island work together to keep the peace. Northern Avalus thinks of Perusa as a primitive tribal city, but throughout its history, it's been the epicenter of biotechnology and medicine. Avalus has a moderate number of rodent citizens who avoid crowded areas out of fear of being trampled on. They prefer to build their houses indoor of regular sized buildings. Rodent friendly architecture has become more common in recent years as businesses hope to attract an entirely new clientele. Mice markets. This bookshelf has information on the Three Kingdoms of Avalus. Avalus. There are three kingdoms the sprawling city of Shang Tu, the high tech metropolis of Shang Mu, and the northern steppes of Shui Gan. Each have their own laws and customs. More information can be found in the corresponding texts. Royal Palace is walled off from the rest of Shang Tu. Much of what happens there is shrouded secrecy, and the Magister rarely makes public appearances. This is a remix of the Fortune Street, or Fortune Night theme from the first game. Shang Mu is the first kingdom in Avalus to allow its citizens to elect their own leader. Despite this, Mayor Zhao has continued to run unopposed for several years in a row. Shui Gong is a tightly knit community. Almost everyone who lives there is either a soldier or has soldier in their family. Shui Gong's population are mostly bears who hibernate, so there is always a workforce shortage during the winter. Those who stay awake until spring are jokingly referred to as sleepwalkers. Bookshelf has information on water dragons. Children who are born in Avalus inherit the traits of their maternal line. Dragons are the only exception. Children born of that union become a dragon half-breed that mixes traits from both parents. Water dragons are so-called because of the indigenous species on Avalis. They were the ones most favored by the Earth Dragons. Their sudden vicious betrayal was a shocking blow to the peace that the Earth Dragons had forged on this once war-torn world. Water dragons were thought to have been all but cleansed from the face of Avalis, a fitting end for their wanton cruelty. However, there have been several recent sightings of creatures that resemble those warmongers, which may indicate that remnants of that race still walk among us. This bookshelf has information on Earth Dragons before Time 1. Before time refers to the period in Avalis's history before the Earth Dragon's visitation from the stars. Many aspects of modern science have society have been influenced by their arrival, including technology and culture. In the past, the world was ravaged by constant war and bloodshed. With the arrival of the Earth Dragons and their enlightened ways, however, the indigenous populations were inspired to put aside their differences. I thought the Magister would be more organized than the Mayor, but he's even worse. He gave me this look when I tried to clean up his desk. He gave me quite the heebie-jeebies, I tell you. 
I helped the mayor keep things organized. As much as he loves history, I wish he'd love putting books back on the right shelves more. It's been so long since the leader of Shang Tu graced our halls. Oh my. What do I do? What do I say? Are my glasses straight? <laughs> Got a couple of guys inside feeding me info on Shang Tu's occupation. Apparently no one's seen a peep of Murga since it. Just want to march right back into Shang Tu and take it by force. But we gotta have a plan first. At least everyone's safe for now. Gotta tell you, those few seconds when we thought Brevin had come back, total panic. Got hairs I didn't even know about standing on end. Askel, though. Askel, though. No wonder he didn't want to go with you. Probably wanted to keep spying on us in the palace. Still can't believe I didn't see it. These books look random, and it was a couple of interesting ones. Oh, it's the same. Bookshelf is full of biographies of famous red pandas. Mayor Zhao is probably related to them. Bookshelf has a lot of instruction manuals for gardening and cooking. Nothing too useful, it seems. I was in Mayor Zhao's transcendental meditation garden, sweeping up some flower petals, when I heard a crash, followed by a high-pitched scream. I assumed it was just the mayor getting mad at one of his visual novels again. Turns out, kidnapped. Oops. Didn't manage to catch up and free him from those ropes, though. I was in Mayor Zhao... Okay. Why do you have a, a thing if you're not going to say more? I know these events are not easy nor pleasant to process, Sash Lilac, but I thank you on behalf of the people of Shang Tu for continuing to stand with us. what happened tonight. Speaking of which... <clears throat> tonight has not been easy. We have lost the battle, but the war is not over yet. We need to devise a strategy. Murga is a threat to all of Avalis. Yeah, and I doubt you'd want her coming to visit your city again, Zhao. <laughs> if that fish face so much as lays a single foot in my city, she'll be fried. Like... like this plate of fried plantains right here. Yeah. Only more like blackened bananas, as these babies have clearly been cooked to golden perfection. Woohoo! Pass me some of that, will ya? One moment. Here you are! Focus! <laughs> so what do we know about Murga, anyway? I mean, what else? Murga comes from a time when Shang Tu was at war with the island nation of Perusa. She was uncontrollable, laying waste to entire armies single-handedly, my ancestors were unable to end her, but they did devise a way to contain her. They just... sealed her and her destructive potential away with the power of the Kingdom Stone. Could they just go to the seal and stone. stab it a bunch of times? So when the stone was shattered, that Brevin, another calamity we can lay at his feet. But what else? Murga seems to be completely set on her vengeance. Why? All the water dragons are gone now. And then there's Bakunawa. Just what is that thing? There's so much we don't know, and the only people who can tell us are long dead. Oh, those people may be dead, but there's no reason why they can't talk. Well, not literally talk, I mean, but... My library has the largest collection of historical texts in all of Avalis. I'm sure I have a few books written by people who lived in those times. Well, that sounds super neat. I'd love to read them. Certainly. Our rental fees are very reasonable. Then I will commit myself to research. Perhaps an answer to our current predicament lies within those texts. I'd love to help too! Um, if that's okay, Your Excellency. A second pair of eyes would be useful. Yeah, while you guys read, I'm gonna go find Cory and talk her out of this. What? Absolutely not. She's with them. That makes her our enemy. She attacked us, Carol. She put you in danger. Okay, fair points all around, but listen, I know how she thinks. It's all about money to her. If you, like, drop some moolah on me to bribe her or something, I'm sure she'd switch sides just like that. Everything you just said does not help your case in the slightest. 
A mercenary who would work for the highest bidder and change loyalties at the drop of a hat is inherently untrustworthy. I concur. It would be an unnecessary risk. Come on, we could use her help. She has that huge airship thing too. <clears throat> Don't mean to toot my own horn here, but uh, fastest airship in the country right here. We appreciate the gesture. And we shall avail ourselves to that service as well. <laughs> oh, well, I didn't mean... I mean, I guess I did. Th thank you for offering. Set. The mercenary is too great a risk. We must focus on the immediate task ahead of us. Assess the threat of Murga and stop this Bakunawa. <sighs> The next morning. Everyone, wake up! Carol is gone! What a shock. Uh, of all the worst times. Traitor! What? Carol? She may be a lot of things, like reckless and selfish, but... She knows where the Magister is hiding and our plans. If she doesn't outright join Murga, then this information will be beaten out of her. It doesn't matter how we feel about her. She's placed our entire mission at risk. And that makes her... A traitor. Do you hear yourself? You're talking about our friend. The captain was our friend. Ascal was our friend. Who's next, I wonder? Are you going to join Murga as well? Nira, calm down! Don't tell me what to do! Stop! Please, stop! I can find Carol. I know her scent. Lady Nira, I know you're hurting, and I know you're having trouble trusting people right now. But trust me. I would never, ever hurt you. Please. You're right. Forgive my outburst. Hmm. It's okay. We'll find her together. Right! We all know where she's going, so all we need to do now is find her sister. Her ship is the Perusian carrier. She'll most certainly have a base <clears throat> in the southern islands. Then that's where we're headed. Nice. Tell Perusa! Hold it right there! You don't honestly think you can get to Perusa without my help, do you? I mean, maybe. Coming with us? Certainly! With our combined strength and cunning, we'll get that fish-faced tyrant a proper what for! He wants to find a new Battle Sphere champion. I want to find a new Battle Sphere champion! <laughs> Very well. Your ship would ease the difficulty of passage. To the skies, my friends! Why are those buildings vibrating? <laughs> there was a whole stage on that ship. Alright, so we got control again. Uh, I don't think we can do much else here. Title gate. Yeah, that's another. We're, we're doing another whole stage. Okay. So yeah, we got a bit more of this to go. Wait a minute. Does you already have the disc here? Yeah, I do. Oh, because I bought it from the shop. That's why. Guess you don't have to find it. Nothing here, right? Basic tutorial. Oh, I don't have any money left either. Okay. So at this point we're kind of it's kind of either move ahead or do challenges. Um, I'll do like one or two challenges because I have to stop in about eight minutes or so. I don't know if I'm gonna come back tonight, but I might. I do know I have stuff to do after dinner, so I'm gonna probably not stream right away. If I do stream, it'll probably be normal time. Use the vanishing block to reach the high ground. Watch your step. Get some decent amount of money. Cyclone! Cyclone! I'm not worth fighting these dudes.
Unequip myself, I'm gonna do these. But you get like an item for doing this? Got a time capsule. Oh, okay. There's a thing for getting all the time capsules, I believe. Bring out challenge, floor's collapsing me. The floor's collap- wow. Brain doesn't know how to do a thing properly. Game broke. Oh, it's just a restart challenge button. Cyclone. Oh, I see they're warning you where the, those come out. That's so loud and annoying. <laughs> at the end, too. Yeah, I think that's, uh, I think we might have to submit that to Galaxy Trail. <laughs> I think that might be something they want to know about. <laughs> It made the game bug out, yeah. We got a time capsule. I don't know what that is. Inventory. So the time capsule's at the top. Clippable items are at the bottom. Doesn't actually say what the time capsules are. Oh, here it is. Sealed capsule containing a rare artifact from the past. There's a computer chip in the base for some reason. Oh, 
Oh yeah, there's like a whole row of uh oh no, never mind, they're not here. Eat the part times in all stages, yeah, no. Less than half the part time. Mira, Mila, yeah, no, that's not happening. We're level two in the Fist of Frog arcade game. Their home run map with ten thousand points or more, all of them, all best. Be, be, be. Achieve a rank of S in every oh god. Complete the game with a total best stage time of less than four hours. With 88 vinyl tracks, 13 time capsules. Activate all nine power plugs in Globe Opera 2. Near and foot 50 damage, single focus. Take a photograph. Take a photograph of the Lil Lila Carol Miller near it in the frame. Oh, that's interesting. Take Captain Claw's challenge in the battlefield without pressing any attack, special, or guard buttons. Collect 30 items. Store all museum exhibits. Collect 9 brave stones, 2 unknowns, 5 charms. Clear stage with a mixture of 5 or more potions. Obtain 75 or more crystals from a speed gate. Within the time limit stone, with a time limit stone equipped, clear stage with 300 or more crystals collected. Clear the game is all the characters. You rank of S in every stage. Clear stage with a brave stone equipped. Okay. Not incredibly necessary to do everything. But we are going to save and quit for now. This is just the badges again. Why is it not why does it work fine here? Yeah. Our photos. Though I do wish uh the thing that says photo wouldn't show up there. Cool! Well, this has been very fun. Uh, this was well worth the wait. Definitely a lot more concentrated content in it than Freedom Planet 1, which was mostly just find the cards in every stage and then play the game with every character. There's definitely a bit more to it, even if it's kind of the same premise overall. Uh, definitely fun so far. We'll have to see how the rest of the game plays out. Um, thank you so much for coming. This stream was kind of special to me because of you know my history with the first game and so on and so forth. Um, I don't know if I'll be back later. If I am, it'll probably be late, like, normal time this evening, because I have stuff I have to do after after I eat. So, probably won't be back right away. But, uh, if I am, I'll probably do more Freedom Planet, but I don't know yet. We'll see. Because I still have, um, a couple other games I want to get done and out of the way. But if you want to watch more streams, check out twitch.tv slash team slash wildabandoned. Plenty of people streaming there right now. Uh, auto host is going away, but if anyone on my auto host is streaming, it'll take you to them. Thank you for coming. You all have a great afternoon, and I may see you later. Good night. Or good afternoon. Or. Sorry. I'm not used to streaming during the day. Yeah. Good night. No, not good night. Fuck. Fuck. Blue. <laughs>